So where we last left off, you guys infiltrated the Space Hulk, uh, went around that minefield delayed for you. You are now coming up behind their blockade they set up for you guys uh, because they're anticipating you guys breaching that 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 gap. Um, you guys crawled through a ventilation shaft, if I recall, popped out the other end, and is now coming up here. So now you guys can make a decision whether you want to engage go around or whatever so quick let's head back through the shaft and relocate their minefield behind them i say we go directly through and meet the enemy head on <laughs> against two dreadnoughts uh maybe not but perhaps discretion is the better part of valor Coward. I, I was just i was just making sure you guys re you remember the dreadnoughts Oh, well, I assume we didn't. <laughs> I think last time we saw them and we tried sneaking and then you failed your silent move by rolling I, 100. I knew yeah, I remember that too. my tea there. So, <laughs> we'll just start afresh and we'll just oh, say... Not only that, that 100 is still rolled, it's the last thing rolled. Yeah. Gotcha. You can fade point it and re-roll that if you want. You got new fade points again. That is true. So were we re-rolling my silent move check? That's the last check. Look at it. It's a 100. So the entire <laughs> enemy force will be descending upon you. Okay, alright. I'm going to re-roll that. Mm -hmm. Alright. Yeah, I, I cannot see that. It's a fate point. Yeah, so you weren't move. here. You weren't with us last game. So. Yeah, yeah, they got yeah, it. just shows a blank silent move and then... I don't know. It's weird. Oh, okay. No, I can see it. Do you see where it says minus 6.1 with the green border? Yeah. So green yeah. border is like a nat highest roll. Oh. Which is bad. Which is bad because it's degrees of failure. All right. It's a damage roll. Then it's the best. Yes, damage good. But, uh, All right, we're going to spend a fate point. Oh, yeah, oh. If you, if oh my over, God. The yeah, duality of the man. If you hover over the number, it shows you the the, the dice rolled. Okay. So you guys that's what happens when you roll a minimum. So that's you guys are still stealthing. Good. So. Oh my god! I roll a hundred last session and now <laughs> it's a yeah. one. Who is the captain again? I think it's me. Okay. Well, we have two captains. No, I think this one. This time you are the captain. No, they. Mm -hmm. they I'm they the squad you. leader this time. Yes. That's right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We yeah. still have two captains. Look at me. I Technically. am now. And the third captain died, I think. Mm-hmm. Captain. No, I think, captain. I think the ship captain. Oh, yeah, I think he died. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He failed on his rolls. Insertion, uh, deployment, uh, exfiltration. He failed on many of those rolls. Except for infiltration. He got like a one. He's like, we're extremely skilled at this. Dies immediately. <laughs> <laughs> Indeed. I can't. I can't the, uh, the we're dies. extraordinarily trained at this exact maneuver. Annihilated. <laughs> we're trained at dying. Yeah. I can't help that he rolled poorly, man. Inquisitorial forces at their finest. I <laughs> would like to suggest that because I critically succeeded on the silent move, that my silence is rubbing off onto other people now. We, I mean, we did all also. Be, like, everyone else succeeded. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So it was everyone just else, you. It was just you that failed. You're like, clunk. <laughs> no, let me try that again. Oopsie. You need to you like, put on your padded. The joint. Yeah, this time he put on his padded, like fluffy socks, to walk around, or the fluffy shoes. Mm-hmm. The ancient relic from Earth. So, <laughs> all right. Uh, did anyone bring a missile launcher? I got Let's your see, missile launcher I... right here. No, I didn't. <laughs> yes, but yeah, no. Uh, so, and... I think our only effective weapons we have fighting dreadnoughts is in melee, which is not a good move because they're dreadnoughts. I failed to see any problems with this. 
<laughs> All right, fuck it, charge. <laughs> I'm also not with you, so. No, you're you you are <laughs> though. Your character. Go ahead, roll a. What is that check again? Awareness. Is that we're all mm. doing that? Uh, yeah. Not not you guys. Oh. Just just Dan. Not Dan. Oh, I'm uh, sorry. Krom. I'm sorry. Just Crom. Oh well, he's oblivious. He's just in his little corner then. <laughs> you could re-roll that with a fate point. What? You only have so many per session. Yeah, three per session, yeah. Right. You'll probably hear something soon anyway. <laughs> That's true. Probably. So, Hearing the fighting. Cool. Although, I will say that as a space marine, we do get plus 20 on our awareness checks. So you technically mm -hmm. passed. Oh, yeah, you did okay. technically pass. Oh. Yeah, okay, so you heard the entire gun gunfight that came into the ship. So your character, uh, I guess, I guess you can do either tactics or intelligence. Uh, and you heard in this direction, by the way. Oh, okay, yeah, I was like, uh, which direction, sir? No, 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 I got you. Thank you. I'm just trying to help your character, like, uh, so. Well, with knowing the last thing that happened, I'm going to sit here in my room for the next couple seconds and wait. Patience is a virtue for okay. the wise. I keep, Karnoff keeps staring at the dreadnoughts, not making any movement. Yep, you just hear them uh, clanking and moving around. They can't brothers. see you if you don't move. Well, they're... Right, brothers, we have a choice here. We can either sneak the other way, avoiding this conflict entirely, or get as close as we can before charging the dreadnoughts. And we must focus the dreadnoughts down if we engage in this fight. There's also opinions. Anything else? Well, I believe we should. Back there. We should attempt to circumvent and outmaneuver the dreadnoughts. A head-on fight would be decisive in their favor. Uh, I'm That's capable, but I doubt I'm that capable. So I think we should probably go around. What was that? Look like a card. Why are playing cards being displayed upon my vision? I think Crom's touching things. Crom, what are you touching? <laughs> Myself. I see oh. that. Well, we don't need to know what you do in your free time. <laughs> you point. Until we get on your time. Oh, okay. <laughs> Are you playing solitaire with playing cards? Is that it? <laughs> yes. I yes. see. All right. Oh, oh okay, he's back. Oh, sorry. You're going right. to make me spit my tea out. <laughs> so, we can try and progress on either side to flank, but the dreadnoughts are the weakest in the back. There is a huge contingent of other space marines there. We could probably take two dreadnoughts on their own, but with a squad of supporting space marines, I doubt it. Agreed. That's why I'm kind of in favor of just going away. I, I say cool. we pair off and flank them in a pincer maneuver. Half of us could go north and the other half could go south. I think the north is closed. Oh. So we can only go south. I will. Okay. They're on to something. They're doing something. I'll just slowly... Just oh, they're moving. Them. Looks like the choice has been made for us. We ignore them and go the other way. <laughs> we go back from where we came from. Well, we better move before they turn around. Yep, agreed. <laughs> Seems clear enough. And do awareness check there, Crom again.
one awareness check as requested. Bolt. It goes to ourself. To ourself. I'm sure you're stealth moving as well. So. Yes. Oh yeah. Yes. Oh. Stealth. Stealth. Anyone that's peeking around to look at him. And I'm fairly certain I still have my uh, possibility shield up. Yep. Yes. Yeah, so anyone who's peeked around the corner, look at him. Just do a stealth check, please. Actually, I actually don't see 10. anyone. All right. Um... And I'll, I'm going to do their, let me get their character sheet up. So we can... uh, conceal move, uh, concealment or a s silent move? Uh, I'll do silent move, I guess. That'd probably be the foot one you'd use, I guess. So... And it's just a straight numbers beat, right? I recall how that works. Uh, it's just, yeah, if it's higher, like, you just need to beat one of the other. Basically, so, yeah, if you silent move is one, the awareness of 1.8 beats that. Yes. Okay. And so. I will use a fake point to reroll that. And Krom, you're you're free to move around and do whatever you need okay. to do as well. Um, yeah, very just, well. Just know if someone spots you, you have to do what they're doing. Yes. All right. There are three to ourself pointing this way. Which way is this way? Towards us? Yes. Ah. I wouldn't have said this way if it wasn't this way. <laughs> of course, Why brother. Why are they pointing towards us? Were you seen? They seem to be unaware of my presence at this point in time. Otherwise, they'd be shooting at me. pointing in a direction? That seems a little weird. Are you guys oh, talking hold in tender? Hold on. Tender comms channel? They're that way. Right. Yeah, are we're you, talking in our helmets. Way. I'll just say, okay. are you are you encrypted or no? Yeah, they're I all. I think we dip switch channels. Yes. Yeah, so they're encrypted. Your your character wouldn't hear anything. No. Um, damn thing. Also, since our last thing, we would have switched to a private channel. Oh yeah, that. absolutely. We had yeah, some probably. idiot talking to not us. A capable idiot though. He was uh, a very capable idiot. He was very the effective first. idiot. Is that the dropship pilot? Yes. I mean, you rolled, you rolled really well. So it's the I don't first know. pilot who's ever rolled well. <laughs> yeah. so First we have, a garden member who has rolled really well. We have two options. Either we go in uh, up close, and that will be the most stealthiest way of dealing with those. Oh, it's not uh, going to be stealthy. It is. There's no oh. obstacles between us and them. They will not see us the moment we step into into the hallway. Then I propose our uh, previous kill team leader steps out and guns them down. He is the most capable at murdering things at long range. Right. Yeah, you do see barricades as well. Or a slight barricade, like about chest high. Uh, they've swiftly erected a barricade in our time that we've no, had no, this no, conversation. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> I was letting you know. Anyway. <laughs> Are yeah. you sure you're not fighting the Imperial Fists? No, we're not sure yet. It could be the Iron Hands. They just painted themselves orange to confuse us. Yeah, maybe. That do be true. I'm not the Iron Hands. Um, the uh, I know Iron Warriors. Trying. I know yeah. who you're trying to say. All right. I don't want to yeah. insult our Tech Marine. <laughs> Fuck will... you, Tech Marine. <laughs> Sorry. Will... What should I say? Domenengo will step out with a heavy bolter aiming down the hallway, and then he will take however many shots it takes to kill them all. I would like to um, take a few moments to try and fashion some of my bolter rounds into uh, makeshift smoke grenades. Can I try that? Alright, I guess if, yeah. uh, if you say that before he steps out, yeah. then... Okay, alright. Alright, so I'm gonna do a tech use. What's the modifier on that, Poco? Minus 20. Alright. Hey! I succeeded. Mm -hmm. 
So I took two magazines worth of uh, bolter rounds, and uh, you can tell me how many smoke grenades I get from that. Uh, that's going to take about 30 seconds to do all this. Um, all right. You, you got six made. All right. Brothers, I say we smoke and push. Very well. All right. So we're going south, right? Yep. How far away are they again? Uh, they're about 90 meters away. Well, that's from that's me, that's anyway, so... From, like, Moth's character, it would be 80 meters. Oh, hey, I like the update. That's a nice, clean little box now. Right. right. A nice clean box. I throw yeah, a smoke grenade down the hallway, from... obscuring the hallway. That's still, yeah, I think that's still over the half a distance, half a shooting distance from mine. Uh, it's 150? 50. For... Yeah. Okay, as soon as you smoke that, Krom, go ahead and do awareness. Yeah. I'm sure that's going to make a big noise and get you I, a I, plus I, 20. Smoke grenade shouldn't make a big noise. <laughs> Just a uh -huh, pop and yeah. a hiss. It'll make a noise. No, it's and not. Inside. Not in close quarters that should be loud well it's not like a, a flashbang oh no like when a smoke grenade goes off in real life it makes a lot of noise for a couple seconds mm -hmm. yeah, that's that's yeah. what that's why i'm assuming so go in, ahead in a in a funny. ship uh maybe throw one to the north too because that's where those dreadnoughts are what is that a, uh work? okay i can do that Nero. Psst. All right. Right. Uh, Press out. Shoot. And those of us who are more melee, start moving forward. So you're shooting through the smoke? What's the shooting stuff? Yeah. Uh, I, I did see where the targets were previously, so I'm just going to pres presume they're going to stay there. Okay. That's in those I'm hearing spots. this. To here, I need. I should probably change my. Yeah, you uh, you you hear all that. You hear that. You hear that loud. Yeah. You hear that noise. That's from up here. Yeah. Yep. Very. You heard the gunfight. You heard the definite smoke pop. I think it was like plus forty for things. You did. Your character is very aware that is. Oh, sorry. Gun, gunfight of some sort about to go that down. Should have been the Manego. Sorry. Uh. And he has a thingy. But he usually gets like plus 60 or 70 on his attack rolls. Right. Uh, shooting through the smoke. If you're already just shooting where they were, go ahead and give yourself. So plus 60, that's uh, four and six. Yeah. So that's like five shots, I guess. Yeah. Minus, minus 20 shooting through the smoke. But uh, that's with okay. taking into account you're shooting at where they were. Without All that, right, so, it's minus 30. So it's, so it's just a three. So basically, it's what, it's what it was then. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. Uh, three shots. Uh, do we know what their armor... Actually, I'm shooting at their 89. Their What's that? Their armor is very tough. Um, That's their left leg. Yeah, that is... The, yeah, the weak points is their limbs. If I recall, you guys determined that the, the weak points is going to be the limbs. I'm shooting basically I'm shooting through the cover. So I guess add the armor points of the cover... To the armor points of their legs. Uh, so five. That's how cover works. Okay, so five plus. And I think it's twenty-four. So twenty-nine. Yeah. Uh. Basically, I do that amount of damage to. What people uh, in the cone? So I guess as every every single one of them gets that damage. I guess. Really, they're all dead then. To the leg? Like yeah, 10, 10 to 12? Uh, 32 damage? That kills them. No, 32. That's no, no, just, that's, uh, like, those are oh. three separate shots. Oh, yeah. okay. The first shot would have done 10. The second shot does 10. The third shot does 12. Okay. Yeah. And that's okay. calculated in their armor already. Yeah. So, if you didn't know there was a gunfight, you definitely know there's one now. Uh, yeah, I can hear it. All right, and he shot. Oh, let me see. How much can I move? Oh, you know what? 
He probably would have done that with uh, my force thingy. So he would have gotten oh, a nice uh, nice possibility shield. Yes. Ah. Or you can add plus 10 to a damage roll and kill one outright. Basically, I, I, I will do that. I'll just add a plus 10 and kill one of them. Okay, so I'll just... Uh, he gets cut in half. All right, a limb just blows up. Yep. Uh, yeah, they're Karnoff. hurt. Karnov, how much can he move? I forgot. Oh, he can move a lot. <laughs> what is it? Hey, I'll just move up to the edge of the circle of the possibility okay. to shoot. I guess I'll protect our tech marine because he's out in the open. All right. What about our tech marine? You're out he's... in the open. I'm, pro I'm protecting you. Okay. Gotcha. I'm just going to advance forward and use you as cover then. Yep. I'm in. Yeah. Um, anyone who can move on the chaos side is going to move because you made a loud boom boom. I took my five steps forward. Right. <laughs> and then roll for initiative. Ooh, I forgot to move. The initiator thing up. Boop. Oh, oh, we were boy, in a surprise I... round. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Guys, can I still act in that surprise round? Yes. You, you can. Yeah. Cool. Oh, boy. Is this a dumb idea? Yes. Yeah, they're out of range anyway. Uh, all right, let me do initiative. Hey, let me just clear the board first, because there's duplicates. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna do my thing again. Right. Is that duplicates? And so... Are we rolling initiative again? Yeah, yeah. because uh, he had duplicates. Yep, it has duplicates for a reason. It doesn't play nice. Okay. Is that one d ten plus plus their whatever or one d five? Twenty ten oh, plus your damn. Or your yeah, uh, uh, Man. Okay. Ooh, turn order has a sort button now. Yes. It's it's always it, had, oh, it had a sort it's thing, but it's got one for it's got one for, for players. Nine yeah. For players, yeah. But every time someone clicks it, uh, I think everyone sees it happening. No. So, uh the one I you got better or Glorious GM was spamming the sword button just now. Oh, that was me. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, Krom, you gotta do your... Uh, yeah, Tessa's trying to explain this to me through text. Okay. It's yeah. It's macros that you guys have. I would just... I would just go... Yeah, you could do that, or you could just do what I did. Just do slash uh, roll yeah. 1d10 plus your agility modifier. Oh, agility. Yes, it okay. is agility. Your agility forty something or fifty something? It's that forty flat. modifier modifier. So it's a plus four then. Yeah, it'd be plus four. Yep. Okay. And then Boca will add you manually, and then later on we can get your initiative thing in there. Uh, problem's in a dicey spot, that's for sure. Yeah. Because yeah. they ran to the gunfire and. I guess he ran out too, so he ran out of his hidey hole. All right. I might have prover proverbially shot myself in the foot. It'll buff. No, also, it'll be fine. Um, I see an escape route for you. Also, Let's goddamn, go. Brazora rolling a fucking initiative <laughs> of 22. Right. 
What the f Jesus. I got a lot of boosts to agility. Right. My initiative counts as double my agility, and right. I have a plus two bonus. Is that everyone well, on the so. board now? Yay. I think so. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Bersora, go. Oh, boy. Wow, these Chaos Marines are really at the bottom. Yeah. Yep. Uh, it's gonna. You guys are gonna get. You guys are gonna get to have work them over. Ah. Uh, oh wait, we still got that free move, right? <coughs> How far is it again? No, we don't no. have that free move. Oh. Uh, but we do have, I believe, the bonus damage versus Chaos Marines. I don't know. It's a. Wow. Uh, no, it's the plus ten bonus to any shooting or weapon skills against Chaos Marines. Yeah. Had about that because that was our our squad bonus we took for this, right? And Crom, uh, you have to be in squad range to get that, and you have to also roll into what what is that thing called again? Well, there's a squad oh, check, which is basically he has to roll under our cohesion score. Yep. And if he fails, then he just has to spend the entire round joining the squad. Yeah. Otherwise, um, if he succeeds that cohesion check, then he's just in without having to take an action. I find it funny that you have to do that. Please leave me the squad. No. Please. <laughs> no. It's it's more of syncing up with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get it. I know. But that's just how I'm, how I'm picturing it. Please let me the squad. No. <laughs> yep. <laughs> just <laughs> stares in angry silence. You have to roll for like a charisma check to convince us to join our squad. <laughs> right. Although, if I remember correctly, our squad. Cohesion dropped to like nothing because we'd use the that stronghold ability and then oh, yeah. no one came near us. So we lost it. Oh yeah. yeah. And that was pretty much spending all of our uh, cohesion score. I really should have sprinted. Well once you turn you can. You, yeah. you go you go before them, so you're you're in good shape. Yeah. So yeah, that's my turn. I can move slightly. <laughs> hey, hey, that sounds Krom. just like my turns. Crom, go! <laughs> <laughs> uh, do I do a full move or do I try and run? Hmm. Oh, you want to take on four guys at once? <laughs> oh, I didn't know, didn't know that there's four more people. Uh, yeah, let's go with that. I mean, yeah, you're... Your characters don't know of it, but Meta, you'll know of it, I guess. I know nothing. Now your, I mean, you can see them on the board. You, that's uh, accounting. Like the vision is like sight, hearing, all that stuff. Yeah. So you know of, you know there's that many. <coughs> see them on the board. You see them. We're going here. <laughs> hey, that's your full turn. Yep. Dominagus, go. All right, Dominagus will shoot again presuming that they are still at the same spots they haven't moved <laughs> yeah. so you get, get the minus 20 like last time alright uh, plus 10 for our squad bonus oh yes I guess and you can do a plus 10 for a possibility show yes so it's back to plus 60 oh they're mega dead yeah, yeah. <laughs> bye, -bye. I can actually show you how dead they are. Let me. Yeah, please do. Uh, 33, which is what? They all hit chest armor. Chest armor, which is also plus five. What's their chest armor? Oh, uh, it's a lot. Let me go look it up. How much? I'll tell you. Uh, 44 combined with toughness and the armor. Okay, so it's going to be 49 because they have a chest high barricade. And that gives them plus five armor. Oh god. Each bullet has to do I don't over think you're 50 damage. them at all with this. Now it's going to take a while. Oh, yep, no, no, no nothing hits. Yep. Yeah, total it, it, negative 91 damage. Bing, 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 bing. <laughs> Even with all those righteous fears. How is how the fuck is that negative? What? Because uh, it doesn't the, hit the armor's armor. too great. Uh, ah. Yeah. yeah. We have to wow. hit him in the arms and legs to uh, actually the head. Him. If I could yeah. get close, I could kill them. What but... is it, Mark III they're wearing? So, yeah, they're wearing heavy stuff. Well, they're um, probably also followers, uh, followers of Nurgle. Mm. Alright. 
We don't see any That's major major plus rules or terrible no, things. Yeah. From, which is no, I believe they're the they were the I have to look up the thing Black Legion or what it was. Well, like, Black Legion is just a combination of all everything. Oh, okay. So it can be them as well. As I was told it was a Black Legion splinter group. All right, oh. so it looks Here's like the... I'm not on the niche, the initiative roll, but it should be my turn. No, oh. you get the roll. Damn. Yeah, How true. dare you? Yeah, these are Chaos Marines, by the way. But yeah, the... did, did you click on your char character token when you did the initiative thing again? Um... Yeah, click your character token, hit the initiative thing, and then just reset in your initiative number that you rolled the first time. Yep. All right, yeah. I'll try that again. What was it? It was nine. Okay, so you're next. All right. I'm not going to screw with it because it's my turn. I'll do it when it's not my turn. All right, let's see. Also, oh, you'll fuck somebody else's turn over. I see. Yeah, mm -hmm. fuck them. It'll well, he's up next anyways after Domingus if he's a nine. Uh, let's see. So if I do a full move, can I shoot afterwards? Is it just a charge and run where I can't? Uh, no. You have to have a, uh, perk to be able to full move and fire. Okay, yep. got it. Because it takes half an action, I think. Yeah. So... I'm gonna move up to here, because it's 12 meters. Oh no, my cover. <laughs> Don't worry, you're still in cover. I'm... It's no, just... You're not. Oh. You are my cover. <laughs> okay, so he was doing exactly what I thought he was doing. <clears throat> All right, I'm going to. I'm going to go ahead and uh, do a bolter shot in full auto, and then. So I'm I'm going full auto. Uh, what is it like? And plus they're within half auto. distance. If they're within half, that's plus 10. Alright. So, it will be plus 30? Uh, yes. I think... Do we? Do you have any, like, bonuses to uh, demons or, like, her heretics or anything? I don't think so. Then it's just plus 30. Alright. And you do four shots. Because right. you're firing full auto. Oh, that was the That's wrong button, yeah. I'm a dummy. Alright. And you can have some righteous fury that. 83, by the way. Which is a leg. So righteous fury would be, what, one more since I rolled a 10? Yep, at the exact same, uh... We have to make another attack roll, the exact same modifier as you used before. So, right. yeah, where are you hitting them? Right leg. Is it auto confirm? Or no, auto confirm. These are the Xenos. Xenos. Yep. Yeah. No, 10 is. Oh, yeah. It is. Oh, t 10 <coughs> is head. Zero one is head. Oh, well, then, uh, yeah, he's probably super dead. I don't know. They should have pretty tough armor, right? Well, right no, it's just their chest armor points. that's tough. I think it's 29 honest. armor, but five. So 24 armor? Yeah, 24 on the heads and legs and 29 on the arms. Right, plus the and 5 for the barricade, minus 5 for penetration, so... Uh, no, uh, no, no, because... Barricade, because if it hits him in the head, that's nothing. No, yeah. left, right leg. Right, oh! Just, no, it, it, fury. no, but like 10 is, uh, head. Because 1 to 10 is head. Yeah. What? He, he, he rolled an 80... He rolled a 38 to hit. That's the attack zone, so it's an 80... Oh, sh I was number. looking at the bottom one. Doesn't Oops. get... Doesn't get inverted, though? Yes, that's why it's 83. Which is the right leg. Yes, my bad. Okay, right leg. So nothing gets the so no damage. No damage. Nothing gets through. Now, can I do a possibility shield thing and increase the damage on one of the attacks? Yes. Yep. All right. I would like to do that. And that would actually probably cost for the twenty-two. Yeah. So what? Yeah. The Which 22. would deal eight damage. Eight. Okay. There's they have one twenty-four guy. armor on the leg, right? Which one is he shooting at? Left so, or right? So it right would right. increase from the 22 damage to the 32. Yep. Right, so which, which, <coughs> which chaos marine were you shooting at? The, one uh, on the, the right? guy on the left. Okay. So this this guy right here. This nerd. Minus, 
Yeah, he's hurting. All right. Did I maybe blow his leg off? That would be pretty sick. No, he's still up. He's hurting really bad though. His armor's shredded. Nice. I'm not still. I'm not seeing the board still there, no. Neil. Why am I not seeing? Oh, I'm. Board? I'm right here. It's right here. No, 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 no. Oh, the the, the turn order. He didn't add himself Did yet. Yeah, I didn't uh, add myself. I'm gonna do I'll, that right now. I'll, I'll just add you. So you said nine. Yeah, nine. Yeah. Karnoth, go. All right. Uh, I can use a charge of my jetpack and get up to this guy. And I can... Uh, 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 question is, how high is their barricade? Like, it's chest it's high, but is how much space is between the ceiling and the chest, like, in the barricade? Uh, quite a lot. You can fly. Oh, okay. Ceiling ships. Yeah, this is, a, this is a space hawk. You could literally fly over it and get behind him. I, yeah, basically just fly over the barricade and I... Strike him down with an overhead swing. Uh, it was this and twenty and charge. Oh god, I forgot. I forgot how to do this. <laughs> Twelve. Okay, fifteen. I think I get a forty-five bonus to this. Oh yes, and I do hit indeed. Where do you hit? I hit on, which is on, 98, which is 89, which is their left leg. Oh, good. Goody. Soft spot. All right. Do your damage. I think I'm booting this. Yeah, I'm going to, yeah. One-handed. Uh, two successes. Yes. Okay. Uh, so what's their arm? Um, 20 24? 20, 20, 20, 24 combined. With the toughness and armor and all that stuff. Pen 10. How much damage did this go? 27 in total. 20, yeah, so it's 14. So 13 gets... He's dead. Boop. That's just after taking in their armor. That's 27 damage they take to their HP directly. Oh, okay. Oh. Well, then he's dead. Either way, he's dead. Either way, he is dead. <laughs> he is Jesus. dead, boy. You sliced him clean in half, brother. He sliced his leg off clean in half. Chop, chop. He didn't need it. It wasn't dead from right. shock immediately. Yep. Yep. Eric, ladies, go. I take five steps forward. Woo! -hoo. And that's my turn. Yay! And he is going to. At you, Karnoth. Yeah, probably at me. Yeah, so... What is it? Plus 20 at that close range? Oh, no, he can't. Uh, There's a min range on heavy boulders, isn't there? A um, minimum range? Nope. I don't think uh, so. Heavy boulders, a, maybe. You They're cannot shoot in the melee range, but you can be close range. It's okay, so I think it's plus 20 then. Oops. All right. That hit. Uh, yeah, 95, that's a leg. Yeah, I think that hits, yes. Uh, Holy let's see crap. How much I can dodge. Yep. Are you gonna dodge? Oh, hold on, hold on. I, 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 <laughs> there's, oh, I have like a 5 billion different things and talents I need to check. <laughs> uh, By the way, that's four hits, Boko. Yeah, that's oh. four hits he's gonna do. So I damaged four more times. Yes, three more times. Three more times. Okay, three three more, times. more times. Out of eight. And what is that hitting me again? Fifty nine to five. That's my left leg as well. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, thirty two. Yeah, mm -hmm. I can tank three of those to be honest, but not the first one. So you want to dodge? Well, start parrying, one. maybe. How many can you? Parry? I cannot parry bullets. I'm sorry. Oh. <laughs> Just get good. 
I, I, mean, I will. You're not, you're not the Eldar. The Eldar can do that. You can't. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna just. I'm just gonna do a plain dodge check. Okay. And I just dodged the first bullet. Yep. And like the first two bullets, and then the rest of the two that hit me in the leg, uh, they just get absorbed because twenty. Wait, hold on. You get a. Roll. I get one damage from each, so I get two damage from both of them. Okay. Uh, don't you have your uh, invulnerability shield? Oh yeah, I have my like I have my uh, power field around me because I have the shield. Yep. Uh. I need to roll on the table. Was it like 1d100? Uh, yeah, 1d100. And if you get like a 10 or lower, I think on your shield, it pops. Storm shields have a different rating. Uh, 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 uh. Storm shield. 55 shield rating that they have. Okay, so I need to roll under or over 55, was it? It's uh, over. Let me just check. I think it's bulk. under. No, because then, uh, like the Iron Halo wouldn't have a lot of sense because its thing is like five, and it's supposed to be the best. Okay, so yeah, no, it's 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 the. F I I think you have to roll under a certain number, but if you roll under a five, then it fails. It, it like activates and then, and then so if the it's result is there. less than is less than or equal to the field's protection rating, the attack is nullified and has no effect. That's so it. I, that's it. Yeah, I just need to roll under. Okay, cool. So it nullifies. Okay. But if you roll under like a ten, it short circuits the field, or maybe a five uh, for you. Uh, because there's see. like there's a a threshold of it just stops. Yeah. Oh yes, you're right. Uh. Computers, that's a yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So right. Storm, storm Shield is 55. Shield. Iron Hail is 50, but that it just stops working is like uh, somewhere between 1 and 10. But I don't remember which one it is for which. So for the Storm Shield, it's 1 to 10. And since I wrote a 7 the first time, it overloads. So the second uh, hit does hit. So I take one damage from that. Yep. Sweet. All right. Man, all that fire and fury, he didn't do anything. Like, well, that was nice, brother. Yeah, you, 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 you nicked me in the leg. You you nicked me. All right, Pizarro, go. How do jetpacks work again? It's been a while. Uh, uh, so uh, add, up, then you come back down. So you have the uh, agility bonus. Uh, it basically it, it doubles that. So if you have a full move of 20, it will become a full move of 40. Ah, so it doesn't uh, double our run speed then. I think it does ru double our run speed. I think it doubles everything. Ooh. But if you run, you can't do anything. You just move a lot. Yeah, which is a problem. Uh, so run is triple your full move. Yes. Do you have enough movement to land on top of them? Uh, depends on what you let me do here with my hip shooting ability, which allows me to move, which allows me to attack while moving as a full round. As yeah, action. that sounds like so what can I do. So yep. can I jump back over to him and shoot him? Yeah, because that's right, what then. the rule says. If the rule says that, then yes, you can move and you can Boba Fett him. I think that means full movement. Uh, well, maybe it's also run. I don't know. It's a jetpack, so I'd assume that's I fine. I skill check maybe for that. Yeah, that's fine. Let's do that. Because you are doing something uh, somewhat extraneous. So minus 20 and pilot check, and then, yeah, you can do that. Oh, boy. You gonna have fun with it, huh? Right behind him.
Uh, any modifier to the pilot skill check? Minus 20. Can you hear me? Yep. No. Yep. Okay. Nope. So, Crom, go. his character is not a space marine, so you just, you would, if you see his character. I can very clearly see. I What is that out of, out of character? Adeptus Sororitas. Yes. He's very pretty well. obvious. Yes. Okay. Well. Yeah, you see like a. I know jet- what those are. Yeah, you see a jetpacky <laughs> person fly over behind something. I don't know if you can see the other guy. I can, can see his ass. Okay, so you know he's flying flying behind the Chaos Marine. Oh so. no, he he. I can see he he's just landed direct. I I was staring directly at the guy. He just landed behind. Yep. Okay. Cool. And while flying over, pulls out two pistols and shoots the dude in the head. Or down at him. Right, let's see what you get. Show me what you got. Question is, what's the modifier on that hit roll? Minus 20. Show us close what range. you got. I think close range gives you plus 20. Then yeah. It's, yeah, then it'd be zero. Just because it's... Yeah, plus he's, he's a chaos marine, so I have bonuses for that, I think. Sweet. And he's a heretic. Goddamn heretics. It's plus 20, then. Ah. They're not <laughs> heretics. Turn They're my minus 20 into plus 20. Okay, yeah. hey, do damage. And he is super dead. Oh, hey. I love Man. these pistols. <laughs> Prom, go. So, however, you want to approach the situation. I sent you something on Discord. Oh. Also, he burns with holy fire. <laughs> you I hope be it's a... not me. <laughs> it burns when I pee. <laughs> <laughs> your faith in the Emperor isn't strong enough. You should be able to, you should I, be I able to charge with your shield. I think Karnath does that all the time. Yeah, okay. you can charge with your shield, yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, uh, sl- slash W is the whisper, so you can slash W and then GM. Okay. Yeah. That way it's easier. I don't like my. Yeah, let me see I unplug exactly my secondary screen, so I have to plug it in eventually again. Uh, okay. Yeah. I, with my boarding shield up, am about to charge up to. Yeah. Boom. Oh, Karnoth, you just see a guy, giant space marine dude with a giant shield. If you'd like to know what it looks like, that picture in the bottom right, that's what he looks like. Yeah, go ahead. You can describe yourself to him. Okay, so, Karnoth, you're the little Adept of Swords, that's right? No. No. That would be Karnoth me. is the big shield guy. Oh, whoever it is. Because <laughs> <laughs> he would... He didn't see you until probably just now. <laughs> yes. <laughs> From around the corner, you see what looks like a full, full, complete suit of Heresy Era Mark IV power armor, complete with the Valor Crest. It The torso is black. It's not jet black. It's like it kind of swirls. Almost looks like someone tried to make it camouflage in the most shitty way possible ever. Mm-hmm. There is... Do you know what a kilt is? Yes. I hope so. He's he's wearing a kilt. It's black, blue, and green. Mm -hmm. Uh, There are bullet holes all over. There is no Aquila at all anywhere on him. There is a Rex Imperialis instead emblazoned on the chest. Uh, Probably the Mm. biggest thing of note to you is there's a big old two on his right shoulder. uh, And then he's got a Rondel on his right shoulder as well that has three little symbols which you may or may not be able to see at this distance but he would able you you would be able to discern that he is also a death watch just he had he this name I, you know I, I wanted to you know not lead with that no I know but I'm just like <laughs> hey, but you're because car- they they all wear the same black so he would be able to yes. discern that immediately so uh like Looking over, seeing that you are vaguely resembling a Death Watch a Space Marine, I relay that information to uh, Euroclades and notify him that there is a Space Marine aboard here. That doesn't There's also a giant, 
boarding shield in yeah. your face. He looks nothing like the other guys. The other guys are like, uh, you know, gold trim, black, uh, big. Lots of skull motif. A lot, yeah, a lot of skull motifs. Although mm. that's not really saying much considering the Imperium has skulls everywhere, too. Yeah, but these guys are like yeah, more true. decked out. More decked out with these skulls. These are more horned skulls. Yeah, and they have spikes on their back and everything on that armor. So they have spikes of skulls through it. They They're have not uh, as good looking as me. Yeah, they have claws for their where their gauntlets are at. Mm. So. Can I ask? Can you're I ask describing what my character looks like. I don't understand. Interesting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Tam Psychers. Okay. Uh, Dominagus, go. It's more like the space shark thing. Uh, Got it. Go. Yep. Okay. I don't think Chrom, you can do anything yet, unless you're nope. picking up stuff. Is Are we still in combat? This? Yes. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, there's at the very bottom. Oh, I see. I see. I see. There's. Oh no. Yeah. What's that? Hold on. I think that's like. Record. This is friendly. Yes. Your character would designate them as friendly Death Watch. This is friendly. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Oops. I South guy. Character. South guy's not friendly, and I call him out to everybody else. Right. You would okay. immediately recognize these guys as Death Watch, like you. Like your okay. former teammates. Because all of it looks like a yellowish orange to me. Right. <laughs> Add so, a character. The, it the all bad guys weird. are orange. The good guys are sort of black. Oh, but space also look alike to me. No, no, no. I meant the actual physical characters they, on the board. They look all yeah. the same color to me. Ooh. Well, that's because the dudes up here are all the same color, but the one dude down here is. Hmm. Domenego will move. Spend his full action moving. Okay. And that's going to be the end of his turn. Yeah, Neil Tyson, go. Neil Tyson. You're muted, by the way. Oh, right. It's my turn. Uh. I'm going to go ahead and do a, let me double check. I'm just going to go ahead and charge to the, to right up here. Cause it's how far I can go. You're a, and it's my turn. And then, Karnoth, your turn. Yes, so uh, I relayed the information to Euclides that we just spotted a space marine here that vaguely looks Death Watch-like, and how do I proceed? Don't lower your god, brother. If he's Game not fire, one of these chaos, right? he needs to explain why he's on a Hulk. Who just are, because so, he's uh, not in chaos armor doesn't make him not a heretic. There's yeah, still right. chaos like, coming. Always keep your guard up. There's no time for chit chat, I, brothers. Why do you think I have a shield? I always keep my guard up. So I go out. I uh, ha uh, har and, har har har, and I <laughs> shout at this uh, guy that, "Hey, who are you? And what are you doing here?" Does it like? You just bring your turn uh, dialogue. I'll then, just, uh, yeah, I'll stay here. Yeah, I yeah, yeah. move. Because you're still oh, technically no. in combat, and there's yeah, more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Prom can really... Yeah, there is one guy up right here. You do have a jetpack. You could jetpack by him and say, who the fuck are you? And then just keep going <laughs> to the other side. <laughs> <laughs> I like Actually, that no, no, I will, I will, uh, what's the movement here? By moving past you, I'm giving you an a crazy amount of trust for having just met. I'm gonna no, I'm gonna move over here. I'm gonna try to protect Brisor in case that this guy tries to charge us oh, and protect you. from the space marine at the bottom. And then I'm gonna ask that question. That's what your bonus action. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> yes. See, I can't respond until my next turn, can I? You can respond. Mm. Yeah, you're just state both. your faith, brother. Death Watch, Imperium. Then our goals are aligned. I relay that information to Euclides. Our goals are aligned for now. <laughs> Don't uh, finish my sentence. All right. All right. 
Eric, ladies, go. Sweet. So you're not, Crom, you're not going to tell him the, the four guys coming up your guys' keister? Uh, I'm thinking about it. Okay. <laughs> Dude, your guys don't know anything about that. You just know of the one. Shh, you know nothing. Yep. All right. All right. I took my five steps forward. Woohoo. You could sprint and just close distance. Right, but then I drop possibility shield. It's just not doing well, anything at all at the moment. Yeah, nobody I mean, uses it. What are you talking about? Our heavy gunner's <laughs> getting the bonus. <laughs> <laughs> shields right in front of you. <laughs> Actual shields. Actual shields. No, no, oh, possibility shield just give everyone a tin bonus, but I mean, you're right. I guess I'll drop it and run another 25. All up, moving the chaos guys. Are you doing uh, dialogue during combat? Is this a bonus action? Or. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I mean, as long as they're not giving long monologues. That's why I asked <laughs> if, if, if it's going to be a discussion, you have to take your whole turn. Yeah, that's where I was like, I figured if I just do anything more than an intro and say I'm friendly, that would, like, for males, like, that probably would theoretically be more than a bonus action. Because I think, Karnoth, you just, you moved and then you dialogued with them, right? Yeah, basically. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. why I didn't want to say anything. Out of character. And then he's going to shoot at you, Karnoth. How many sh uh, shots in the clip does he have? That's a lot. Yeah, how many That's how many lot. rounds in the clip does that weapon have? Uh, t ten. Holy crap! Ten? Oh boy! Well, That's if it's like on. one of our bolters, the max bullets you can shoot oh, yeah, on yeah, full yeah. auto is four. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so he has a clip of ten. What? Well, yeah, even, even if he has a clip Sorry. of ten, what's his rate of fire? Three. Yeah, you, you can only fire three bullets. Three. Okay. Uh, where does that hit you? That's a fifty. That's center chest, right? Oh, oh that's that, awesome. No. Yeah, it is fifty. Okay. So, uh, oh. negated, negated, and negated. Yep. Sweet. With the I just raise my shield dead. and I just stand there and just block the attacks. All right. Yeah, Karnoth is. Like, because I made these guys tough, but Karnov is like a damn mobile tank. He's built for tough. Yeah, he's... Uh, Persara, go. Your character is now made aware of that Krom, that other character in front of you, so... How do you wish to proceed? Oh, I did I did shout out loud. Like, I did... Uh, yeah, that's why, his, that's why his character is made aware of that guy now. Yeah, he's, he was facing the other way towards that space brain, and then you're shouting out behind him. So he's now turning around. He sees yeah. that. Yeah. And he's like, "Fuck it, get the space, get that chaos brain over there." That just shot yeah. at Karnoth. <laughs> yeah, don't care. <laughs> That's great. Because <sighs> he figured Karnoth has it. All right. Uh, oh, well, the same thing again. I just blinked and you moved. Yep. Yep. He's using jetpack. Oh no. Uh oh. Uh oh. So your character would... He was using a fate point. Yeah, you're going to be falling to the ground, but you can use a fate point to save yourself. It's up to you. Fuck! So another fate point? Yeah. Can you can you shoot it while flying, but then just end up prone? That's probably going to happen. So you can start right, to do damage, you'll just not be able to move afterwards. That's right. Then I'll do that. I'll take the damage. I'll You'll just fall. Yeah, I mean you won't take any damage. You're just gonna be prone. <laughs> okay, oh. do your damage. Yep. And and he's dead. He is smoked. Holy shit! <laughs> you just do like like the the Neo Matrix move, basically. Essentially. So let me give me the prone icon. And that. Okay, and Krom, it's your turn. That does Steal crazy yourself. damage. And I'm then. immediately doing a 180 from my position with my shield readied, and I am, uh, what should we call it? I am resting my uh, spear on the shield. 
And I'm just go I'm going to turn to whomever this may be and say, steal yourself. Wait, you're facing to me? Uh, no. I'm saying that to you, and I am now facing this way. Oh, wait, he's facing away. Uh, oh, okay, okay, okay. So yeah. you want, yeah, failing formation, essentially. Ooh, by the yes. Way, by the way, just so you know, Boko, standing up for Pwn is a free action for me, so I just get back up immediately. <laughs> Nothing happened. Nice. Do your character want, want, he went, YOLO! <laughs> no, I think it's a uh, free action. Oh, well, never mind. Never mind. I will be right back with a... Let a dog out and feed him. He's lying. Anyways, so Ooh, you... let the dogs out. Okay. The... Is that your turn? Yes. I okay. have uh, engaged in dialogue for the majority of my turn. <laughs> That's turning around. Yeah. No ammo, so I guess you can't do much. Uh, yeah, Dominator, let's go. Uh, the Menango will go. What's his movement again? 24. Huh. I still I can't see anyone other than actually this lady yeah. and this dude. <laughs> but you do know that you're you do you did yes. see them, so you do know they're coming up your keister. <clears throat> yes, that's that's why I'm in a phalanx in a doorway. You'll be like, oh hi, you're clearly. It's gonna be the end of his turn. Do your captain? Uh, captain. Does captain. your helmets uh, have your ID tags on or no? In lore. In character, I don't think maybe no, I don't think so. I, I'm wearing like a I'm a black shield. Okay, very well. My mine would be on mm. if that helps. What Depending on <laughs> you, well, you've been there quite some time, so some yeah, some things are not m malfunctioning. So you're not sure if it's fully functional, but you just uh, it's on. It keeps popping up as uh, Praetor Ilkairn. Okay. Nice. Whether or not you know what that is, that's that's up to you and your character. Very well. Okay, and then Dominic gets the move. Dominic Did he move? Wait, Dominic already moved. He okay, uh, Neil Tyron, go. Not. Sorry, I didn't get confirmation if he moved or not. All right. Uh... I'm just going to go ahead and take up a position over here. So you just press Actually, the I'm going to get... Yeah, I'm just going to get right behind him and uh, probably brace my gun over the top of his shield as well. All right. It's a big shield. Yep. And then... Karnoth, go. Mm-hmm. I'm going to move up here and just join the rank. And I'm going to privately tell uh, Eurycleides that his name is uh, Karen. Apparently. That's going to be the end of my turn. All right, Eurycleides, go. I'm going to run. Hold up, guys. I'm getting there. All right, that was my turn. <laughs> 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 All right. And then they're going to make a full run. Out of character, are those all Terminator models? They're yeah, they're all big bulky guys. Like everything they've encountered has not been like Okay. <laughs> yeah, they're all Jeez. They're all equipped for battle. Like these guys, you, you haven't seen anything other than big bulky Hermes. ass bullshit. Yep. Sounds about right. Yeah. Yeah, uh you weren't here for the debriefing, but they these guys are specialized in like siege warfare and uh war Whoa. machines. What so a coincidence. That's, that's all they do. So What a coincidence. Guess who else specializes in siege warfare? I wonder. <laughs> that's hilarious. But yeah, 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 yeah. But uh, well, yeah. Uh so but all this was set up before they engaged this mission. So mm. um I wanna see what they get be thrown at. Alright, Brasora, you ready to get shot at? Sort of way the fuck down. Oh, oh, oh! That's a problem for that lady. It'll buff. It doesn't like show us. Like we don't really can't see down there. Right. Can, yeah. Aside from them. 
And then damage. And then the other guy's going to attack. Was that like full auto that he did? Yeah. Uh, and then that's like two shots. Okay, so I'll do one more. I wasn't sure if 1.4 would be two. So there's that other one for that one, and that guy also, I guess, got two off. So there's yeah. the damage. There's all the damage for all everything. Yeah. Both, you're being shot at. He's already I think dead. Moth wants to take their dogs out. Oh yeah. Oh, that's right. So, but when he gets back, though, we tell him he got shot he at by, shot. by the two by the two space marines in full auto. And there's the damage output. So what you're saying is this Moth character is probably going to die. Uh, uh, maybe. Oh, maybe. Ooh, we don't know that. We we don't know. Most likely. It'll buff. He's not a space marine. No, it won't. You're, no, you're, you're, missed, uh, you're imminent death. Oh, you're God. Getting, you're getting shot at. There's the damage. And there's the they full auto. Both guys full auto on you. Oh, man. Even in the little corner, oh, man. Are you in a corner? He yeah. is in a he's corner. In a corner. He has, oh, like, okay. I, I didn't mean, depending see. on where they are, it looks like he's got... Okay, then... Or anything up to here. Yeah, no, 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 it's a corner corner. So if he's in a corner, then you're good. I would say, okay. realistically, unless so, it's like further so they got here. Right, so they got to choose a new target. Let's see. Okay, so... And they probably missed, because that, that plus 20... I don't think they can hit anything that far, do Uh, They have a 100 meter range. Oh, never mind, as I was. Oh, I guess they're right. gonna shoot at me then. Uh, or Eric Ladies. Uh, they're gonna shoot at. Who's this guy? That would be me. Okay, so they would shoot at you, but they had a 1.4 degrees of success and 1.9, and they would lose the bonus of the 20 since they're not half range, so they would be missing you. So all that missed. Pow 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 pow. Good catch. <laughs> catch that little corner there, Moth. I didn't even see that. Oh. <sighs> Bullets whiz yeah. by. That's why I went on that side of the Space Marine. <laughs> I figured, hey, quarters are safe. What if they come down this hallway? Smart man, Moth. Smart right. man. Sorry, smart man, Moth. Yeah, good call. Because, like, if I didn't see that, yeah, you've been just hit. And I didn't see it because your name was blocking it, so that's my yeah, bad. If, if I could recommend, don't go further down out of character. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it, it kill me. I could get down there and kill one of them outright, but I will die in the process, I bet. Chain sword you down, probably. I guess I'll just have to use my weaker bolter weapons. Oh. Oh, man. So you're going to stay in that cover and just poke out and shoot and then go back in cover? Yep. Okay. Okay, how far are they? They're about 50 meters from you. That's half of 135. Yep. Yeah, they, they got a bonus against you, so you get a bonus against them, too. Because they're actually not behind that car, but they're actually in, in the... They actually poked around that opening, and they're coming down that hallway, because, I mean, they're not very fearful of getting shot. Where does that hit? All right, the first one hits uh, 19. That is uh, right arm. First two That's hit right arm. So right arm is, I think, 20. Let me go look at it. I think it's 29 total. Oh, and the next shots all hit the head with a zero. With a zero three. That's nice. Yeah, so his arms are 29. So. Nothing. Really? Four. A 20 oh, yeah. damage with four pen does nothing. Yep, four pin, and the next one does three. I don't think I can deal damage with the bolter at all. I mean, no, you max can, roll because... of 20. No, you, have, you can max roll of uh, 28. If you hit the leg, you can deal damage. That would deal damage to, I guess, a leg? No, it wouldn't. That would do zero still, wouldn't it? Yeah. Anyway. You only got a 12 on your first roll. Yep, you're at a disadvantage. What is this? No damage. You have the macro for that, but all right. 
Yeah, I forgot to use. Well, twenty three would twenty three would do one point of damage. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and I also got a twenty five. And yeah, and a twenty two and a twenty five. Yeah, you could deal damage to them eventually. Barely. It would be a fight and a half. Crom, go. Mm. By the way, those last four shots all hit the head. Oh, those are, those are actual hits. Mm-hmm. Okay, so what's the damage totals? One. No, that's four. Four. Oh, sorry. Also, plus one more damage for each of those because they're chaos. Okay, so... Six, four, ten, thirteen on one. So yeah, he did. He did quite a. Said all head. Those last yep, four. Those last four were all head. Yeah. So he's hurting pretty bad. All right, Crom, go. Sorry. Can I hold my turn? Yeah, you're gonna steadfast your weapon and hold. Yes. Okay. So I guess you get attack of opportunity as soon as they get close. Then. I have a spear and I'm ready to use it. Yeah. Um, <laughs> you, can they just, uh, you can just make like a, you can just go down in a turn order and just act later than everyone else. Just yeah, like that's my time. intentions. Dominus, go. These guys are probably smoked though. <laughs> Dominus, whoa. Oh, we still have people back there. Yeah. One. We have person back there, not people. Oh, I He's see the a big, big heavy blue. bolter get fucked guy. Oh, I see a big blue line just all the way back there. I thought someone was like way mm. back there. Question How far away are the baddies down the corridor from Dominego? Because I can't really see them in the darkness. Uh, 122. Yeah. 120. For yep. the first one, and like 124 four for the second one. Yep. Okay, Domenico cracks his neck and then <laughs> picks up the heavy boulder, and it's going to shoot down. That's minus, uh That'd be minus 30. I'm shooting. He's I crouch. Shooting beyond, shooting beyond visual range. <laughs> <laughs> Good idea. Make You're still very big. I don't think that would help. No, <laughs> I, while crouching, I stand at full space marine height. <laughs> yeah. No, no, no. Just uh, just stand behind the corpse of the Astartes you just killed, the uh, Chaos Marine right here. Right, yeah. so minus 30, though. Uh, don't fail, you probably will hit Eric Ladies. So uh, we have yeah, this, this, 40. Eric, uh, Eric Ladies and who's the other? Neil, yeah, he has a line of fire. And Brasora is also downrange. Yeah, don't There's fail. Don't range. miss. Yeah, don't fail. Well, just Luckily, remember you should that. hit them before it hits me. You do get that plus 10 because they're space marines when attacking them. Yes. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. Really incorporate all the bonuses. Uh, I think I... Uh, oh, wait. You don't have the shield, right? So that's going to be just three hits. Okay. To where? Uh, and they all hit uh, on the head. Oh, my God. They're probably dead. So 24 is Oof. their armor on the head? Yep. Uh, 12, 17, and 16. Ooh. Uh, so the first guy is dead off the first shot, and then the 17, 16, uh, next guy's dead, so. Ding, ding, ding. Yep. Both headshots? Is that to one guy, or that's to both, right? Uh, is that all guess? shots? Oh, so man. All the shots okay. I do. I think yeah. it's to both of them, yeah. Sweet, uh, yeah, they're dead. <laughs> like, uh, mega dead. <laughs> Neil Tyson, go. All right. Uh, because my gun is already braced over uh, Krom's shield, do I get any bonuses? Plus 10. Plus 10? All right. And they're half range, so plus 20. So you get plus 30. All right. Rolls a natural uh, 100 on his plasma pistol and has to throw it again. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to aim at the guy in front, but... I might collateral them because they're pretty close together. <laughs> All right. 
it's what is it uh, plus 50 total then because it's full auto and half range yeah I don't right. like it. You got the full auto of plasma. Full auto Not plasma, plus three, just half a range, bolter. But... Yeah. Oh, you're using just a regular boulder? Yes. Alright. Okay. And that's uh, 56. Chest. Oh, no. Pink, pink, pink. And, and pink. Or maybe not pink. No, actually, nope. that would be a plink. It's 27. <laughs> if the armor's 46 40. or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let you me know double. that's going through. Oh, bad. Yeah, you tickle them. Yeah, uh, let's see. There's Does uh, Air Clavies have the possibility shield up? You, nope. you can make a cold shot. I had to turn it off so I could move. Right. Yeah, you can, you can, you can do a cold shot, which uh, you basically you choose the part of the body, but that's like a minus 20. Uh, uh, you can, yeah, you can use a fate point and reroll your attack there well what you what was uh dan saying uh, you can do a cold shot uh, action which uh, you can target a specific body part uh, but that's like a minus 20 to hit okay i don't think i did that you want to do, do um, a pay point and roll again well before i do that i want to uh do righteous fury because i did roll a 10 so I'm gonna have to do another two hit roll to confirm. And let's no, just just one. You, you can max roll a twenty five damage with five penetration. That's not getting through their chest armor. That's All right. Whoops. Yeah. But the hit location might be the head. True. So we're seventy seven hit. Well, he missed anyway, so it doesn't matter. Oh, oh no, he didn't use the bonuses. He would have hit. Oh wait, no, I think it's the base, right? Or is no, no, it, it's it's with bonuses, so it would be with the plus fifty. So he would have. Yeah, hit. he, he oh, would okay. hit. Yes. Uh, so seventy-seven is what? Uh, leg. 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 All right. So this shot will hit him in the leg. Uh, might right. deal damage. Yeah, yeah, might. You have to max your damage roll. Damn it. So twenty-one. Yep. Ping, 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 ping. All right. Rats. All right, and that's my turn. Garnoff, go. Hmm. Why did you boost all our weapons except your own? <laughs> I don't know. I, I think you ran out of time. Yeah. Probably. Might take quite a while. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So very. Hmm. Hmm. If we just end there, I'm going to take a shot. Mm. I'll bind them, sure. I can go up to the this guy on the right. And charge him. While well, still facing this way. Basically like... This. And... That's what you're watching yourself and, between them. Basically, going to melee. Uh, not between them. Um, it's most like most like, if you want to shoot the guy on the left, you can. Uh, but the one on the right is like, uh, I'm in combat with him, basically. All right. Uh, what was it? Hit, charge. I think that's forty-five. Let's see. Oh yeah. <laughs> and Oof. Yeah, hold up. Let me see. Because they can parry. What was it? Weapon uh, skill again, right? 83. Yeah, weapon 83 skill is their leg, for right? Parry. Yep. Oh, okay. If they parry that, then I guess they parry that. I can't do much. Alright. Yep. And my turn. Eric ladies, go. Alright, cool. I'm going to unfettered. Uh, launch a Cybolt uh, here, which both of them will be in that six meter radius, and Karnoff will be outside of it. Okay. Was Cybolt do just straight damage? Uh, yeah, but I make it like a normal shot. All right. We can do this oh. now. Ooh, that does look nice. That looks so much nicer. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, oh, God. No, 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 no. 
Yes. Yep, right there. Cool. Hey, if we were using the old measurements of the map, it would be. Yeah. Oh, you're right. Okay, cool. Uh, no, if we I were succeeded, using the old measurements, that's And it's me. not a double, so I don't incur, uh, I don't have to roll on the psychic table. Uh, so that's just going to be 66, or 6010 damage. 6010. Six. Yep, 6010. Alright. Holy shit. So they're going to die before they get a chance to melee, then, is what you're talking Well, unless I roll really badly. Isn't that a Wretched Fury? Yep, it absolutely is. <laughs> Who would have guessed? Uh, and that's 44 damage? Yep. Yeah, they're already dead. Smack so. them around a little bit. Uh, does it does it go through armor? Uh, it has six penetration, so. Oh, uh, okay. Hey, that one hits too. I think I think AOEs take the body armor's uh, AP. It it would they go. They do. Hey, look, that hits as well. That's that's four that goes oh, through. Oh God. You said six, so that's forty. Hey, 30. look, that hits as well. <laughs> hey, look. I'm recognizing a pattern here. Oh, that one fell, but I'm going to wait before I uh, re-roll. Right, so <laughs> 44 minus 38, because you said it's a pen of 6. And yep. that's damage through 46 minus 38, 50 minus... Let I think you it. fucked them up pretty good. Uh, they either fucked up or dead, so let me figure it well, out. Well, if they're not dead, I'll spin a fate point and re-roll. Well, if they're not dead, I held my turn so I can just walk up. And... If they're not Maybe dead, we cool. have a problem. No, we have solutions. We just haven't the used them yet. So yeah, but the problem is they're not normal chaos space marines. Yeah. And Those guys are something else. Yeah, they're future corpses. Eight, eight plus six, fourteen, fourteen, and then I think I think they're dead. Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon future corpses. <laughs> yeah, they're they're both dead. So they're just they're both just dead, even with that armor. Uh, can wh whoever that. Where is it? Get rid of it. I did. Uh, I still see I it. I still see it. Oh. Yeah. You can get rid of it yourself. There should be like a little thing. I clicked the it. garbage right. can I icon. I clicked garbage can. No, no, get rid of that shit too. Oh, okay. I'm going to go up and loot. I need to loot one of these corpses now. Yeah, combat's over. Uh, before you do that, though, after having just unleashed hell upon those two space marines, uh, a Goliath hulking space marine turns to look at you. I stand ahead above everybody else. Uh, what a coincidence! So do I. Uh, I'm. I would be even taller than your average salamander. Uh huh. I also don't know which character is supposed to be yours. Uh, as well. well. Okay. Yeah. So the guy yeah. behind me. Yes. Okay. The other Very guy behind you. Yeah. 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 That guy. Greetings, guy. brother. Karen, was it? Yes. What is your purpose here, and what chapter are you from? Chapter being like, what part of the Death Watch? Because I assume you so, stated before that you've got the insignia of the Death Watch on you. So, looking at me further, you see... Hang on. I'm gonna... I gotta pull up something from... You see a clavis on my entire left arm. Uh... You would recognize me as a Death Watch keeper, out of combat. Oh. Uh, I, I don't know if, how familiar you are with the keepers out of out of out of, uh, out of character. I I barely remember them. Uh, there's very very few of them, and they're typically entrusted with like really important shit. Cool. Uh, uh, anyways, my mission is my own, as I was sent on. I've come from the Keepers. What are you doing here? I was not aware of another party. Nor were we. Hmm. If you don't mind, brother, I'd like to examine you a moment. And me being a librarian, I think you know what that means. Turn yes, your head and I, cough. <laughs> that I... But we shouldn't... I tilt my head. I'm not a, I'm not a doctor. <laughs> if it... No if offense, brother, but we are on a space hulk. This is not my first time in the unknown, brother. Perform your tests. I have nothing to fear. Excellent. And then I'll do, like, my reading thing. 
uh, you will discover you can you have a lot of difficulty reading me. Hmm. Well, I don't know. I'm really good at well, psychic shit. Does that do? Are you gonna oppose the willpower check? So, that was my reading test. Okay. Um, the three point five was my reading psychic ability, and then I'm gonna use sign of science to try and detect any uh, like chaos taint. Point out, I have beyond reproach. By default. What's that do? Uh, those who recognize the keeper will respect his, his position and favor him with their trust. By default, I automatic it automatically applies when dealing with anyone from the Death Watch. We've had a lot of betrayals. <laughs> <laughs> so that doesn't amount for much at this point in time. Yeah, as long as I go, all right, not chaos tainted, you'll have your proper <laughs> respect. I also gain a plus 30 to resist all attempts to control my mind. And oh, it's not controlling your mind or anything. It's oh, just okay. to read your aura, maybe surface thoughts, if that. Oh, very well. Uh, you detect I'm very hungry. <laughs> but that's <laughs> not necessarily a good thing. It's actually your three your three uh, highest emotions is what I would feel from that reading. Brother, there's some chaos corpses mm -hmm. right over there if you'd like a lunch. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> this Anyways, this back guy. in character. <laughs> that is in this. character for him. <laughs> yeah, I'm a yeah. bit of a dork. Yeah. And you While you're saying this, I am uh, currently looting the corpse that I think was like right here. Yep. All right. Do I find anything, by the way? Uh, let's see. Roll for so search, they... maybe? No, I mean, I can tell you what's on them. So, uh, each one of those guys has a demonic bolter. Range of 100, 2d10 plus 8, clip size 10, rate of fire is single shot, 3, tearing, reliable, enemies... Uh, I must have forgotten this, but it's whatever. I don't think any of them hit you with it. Must make a will save to avoid fear effects. Any pistols? They they have uh, chain needs. swords. No, none mm. of that on them. No, you may not need a scavenge for much. Uh, so, with a four point nine, do I detect any kind of psychic taint on them uh, or uh, chaos no. taint on them? No. Uh, you know, other than the blood that sp that he spilt. But right, yeah. right. My apologies for the for questioning your validity, Keeper. Right. We've had many issues in the past before, and we still currently have to prevail through them. Oh. It seems you're missing a weapon. Here, I hand you my bolter rifle. Right. Uh, for clarification, I'm holding a spear and a shield. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, you said you were looking for ammo. It bounces off his was... helmet as you toss him to him. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was looking for... Uh, so, in, out of character, I was looking for a pistol. In uh, in character, um, I'm going to say, my pistol was damaged when I initially boarded. Then here, take mine. I have very little need for it. Right, and Ericlades, you got comms. Yeah, I, I saw it. I was going to okay. deal with this first. Tell Inquisitor. Me, how many of your number boarded? This many. Ah, you have fared better than my party. How many of yours boarded? Eleven. That is most unfortunate. They are I with the not, Emperor now. I have not seen any others in several weeks. I had hoped you might have been them. I take it you have not encountered any others on your travels through this Hulk? Only heretics. I presume they are all dead. The ones who do not hide behind a veritable force field of minds. Yes. Or dreadnoughts. <laughs> or dreadnoughts. <laughs> I think that you encountered their likes too. That's... Yes, they are behind us down this corridor. We should proceed further in. Now one moment while I speak to the Inquisitor. Very Inquisitor! <laughs> If that is, in fact, you... Oh, I don't know who's where. <laughs> yeah, it's report in, kill team. I don't know, maybe we don't get no, it. No, no, you're no. not getting it. It's private comms. All Just right. Eric Lady. Well, yeah. that's a fake Inquisitor, then. <laughs> maybe. Again? <laughs> no. I would... Third time's a charm, right? <laughs> I'm going to take this since moment it's... while he's talking. Since it's an Inquisitor, 
Do you want to use science science or something like that? To, to no, 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 no. Since it's an Inquisitor mm -hmm. who's worked a lot, I'm sure there'll be some kind of call and response to properly prove who we are to each other. Yes. I would like to go through that call and response. Okay. Whatever that is. And you're, he gives you the proper call and response. Excellent. So, you definitely it, know... It, it seems good. one of the Chaos Elements hijacked our comms and tricked the dropship to a different landing spot <laughs> and destroyed it. Didn't he blow them up and get out of there? Yeah. No, he didn't. No, he didn't. He didn't oh, that was the last mission. That was his last thing. He landed in the bay and then destroyed as many as he could before they destroyed him. I thought uh, he got away. No, he got away. Oh, did he get away? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I want to read through that he again. He even flipped them off, Leaving. <laughs> oh, no. I, I even read that. <laughs> oh, okay. Chaos oh. Marines took a big fat one, confirmation of my comms, I'd like to send my finger and salute to the squad of Marines he said to destroy this craft. Peace out. <laughs> cool. I don't Most know if you badass dropship pilot in history. Yeah, that's why we respect that guy. He's the first and only pilot to ever actually do his job. <laughs> yeah. But, anyway, but yeah, so uh, the rogue elements had hijacked our comms and lured our dropship to a false uh, landing spot. I believe he managed to make it out, however. We have currently progressed further in and we have encountered another kill team. Uh, what remains of it? Do, 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 Who's voicing do, this guy, do, by the way? I believe <laughs> I was... If it's Blackthorn, right. I believe I was voicing him. Yeah. yeah but I'm waiting for Bogo uh, to type. Oh, well, yeah. Well, I was going to oh. do a private chat with uh, Eric Hazer, and he can... Yeah, do your little private chat. How do I okay. uh, whisper or whatever mm -hmm. to the GM again? Cast, uh, slash w. w. Yeah, slash W. Space GM. Oh, space, space GM. Ah. Yes, space as in a physical space, not space as in SPAC. You you might want to uh, test it first just to make sure. I'm presuming that worked. Yes, it is a keeper cairn. And are you aware that they were meant to retrieve an artifact? I'm sorry, who was that to? What? That is to the Inquisitor. Oh, okay. I can't hear yeah, this conversation. Yeah. I'm I mean, not on your frequency. Yeah, I would like to not reveal, you know, mission details as much as possible. I don't have your frequencies. Yeah. Yet. Yeah, he's talking to the Inquisitor. I'm currently inspecting everyone that's here, trying to figure out who is what. I'm watching for more targets down the hallway. You're, yeah, that's in case. I'm moving towards. You're I'm able to... to it's pretty obvious that I'm a tech marine and um, I'm a little bit dorkier than everybody else. <laughs> I'm a goober. I would like to remind you, Inquisitor, that having information is important for us to do our job successfully and without unnecessary loss of life between deaf crew, uh, marine kill teams. In the future, I would respectfully request that you give us proper information before boarding a Space Hulk. Especially if there's another team on board on the same fucking mission. Oh man, you're giving the Inquisitor lip. <laughs> oh boy. That's why I said respectfully. <laughs> ah. Right. Who is this to my left? I respectfully request to take a dump on your doorstep. <laughs> he broke in. I have, spot. have you recovered the artifact? Uh, at this, uh, I kind of perk up and and turn my head. Perhaps I have picked up many things in my several weeks aboard this craft. Tell me, of which artifact do you speak? Well, here's the second question: Were you also sent here by Inquisitor Blackthorn? Hmm. Yes. Right. Well, the little bastard failed to inform Inside either one of us check. that uh, there he was sending multiple kill teams on the same mission. Maybe. How long ago did you receive your briefing, brother? Uh, a day. <laughs> that may be the issue for you. 
I was sent here approximately one month ago. And he failed to inform us that there had been a previous team sent in. It would have been great knowledge to know that you were even here. Regardless of Assume that nonsense. If I were to guess, we were presumed dead. They did not think that you would find us, nor would we be a priority. I would expect nothing less. Tell me, what were your orders with this artifact? Retrieve or destroy? Retrieval. Hmm. Then I suggest we leave. And you have the artifact on you, then? I'm gonna turn around, walk back towards you, and pull something from my belt. <laughs> Does it look cylindrical? <laughs> yes! <laughs> <laughs> it, I okay. Actually, because I'm holding, I have one here. I'm literally just gonna go, and then as I walk past, I'm gonna go. We can leave then, brother. And I'm right. Gonna it's, 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 yep, yes, it's but a, wait, but wait, first, wait, wait, please wait. hand us the artifact. Hold up. Is that a cylinder or a cylinder? It's a cylinder. It's a cylinder. It's a Which cylinder. It's a cylinder. It's a cylinder. It's a very easily recognizable cylinder. All right. It is a cylinder, and I'm going to respond in character to your question of, can you give it to us then? Uh, oh, wow. That wasn't that a ball. question. No, no, no. I'm going to respond to it exactly like it was a question. Okay. Seeing as I am the last of my team who also had the mission to retrieve it, I shall hold on to it until I am dead or my mission is complete. That's fair enough, Tech Marine. Stand down. Understood, brother. We shall escort the Keeper back to the drop point and leave, as our mission seems to be halfway complete unless you had other mission parameters hang on i need to check my notes yep yeah <laughs> was it just kill everything on the way in grab the it just it whips out like a like a journal are we on mission <laughs> three now journal. said it uh yeah okay as you've said you have not encountered any others from my kill team yeah, no, it's just gather intel. And then we also have a tertiary to eliminate the Chaos Space Marine forces. Now, if we we haven't eliminated all of them. Because that would involve fighting two dreadnoughts. I bet, though, if we find the reactor room, we can plant some melt bombs because I do have a couple of those left. So well, that would be one reactor room Marines, of about 20. Ah. That would also be, like, one reactor room of, like, 20 reactor rooms on a space oh. hulk, it wouldn't work. Gotcha. Say. Sorry, I'm thinking in character for a second. Mm -hmm. oh. Whatever our decision, we should move. This yep. engagement will have attracted attention. We either yes. move deeper and attempt to eliminate more, if that is your prerogative, or we should leave. But I doubt we have enough firepower to completely rid an entire Space Hulk of all of its inhabitants. Oh, that's too nice. Now I was that our mission. But we will eliminate any in our way. Did you place a tracker? On who? The Hulk. If we cannot eliminate it now, we can at least set a tracker and send other teams later to begin purging it. I presume there is already a tracker since we were led here by the Inquisition. Very well. Also, not our mission. Hashtag not my mission. So, are you ignoring the Inquisitor now, Librarian? Yes, yes he is. I, I can see that. <clears throat> okay, uh, yeah, so I'll reply back to the... Uh, Inquisitor Doofus. <laughs> what are these? What do these goobers look like? This is a tech marine from I don't know what chapter. Iron hands. Iron hands. Oh, very well. Uh, this one. Karnoff Black Shield, South Marine. Black, Black Shield. Very well. That's the one I was fighting alongside. Yeah. This is an Adeptus Sororitas. Yep. Also uh, the Inquisition. Throw it. Throw an agent. Ah. Uh, uh, you may or may not not like the stuff on my armor. 
Are you a heretic or a Xenos or uh, um, Chaos? Oh, OOC in a sense. Uh, I'm going to send you a picture. Actually, I'm going to put the picture in here because I don't feel like describing. Give me a second to find it. The uh, picture is also the one he's using in Roll20. Yeah, but yeah, it's not really. It's hard to see it because it's smaller. What the hell did I put my phone? This is why I, I like turning it on. Like... I say to the Inquisitor, Yes, he has retrieved the artifacts. We are escorting him now to the drop points. Kind of wish I could see what the Inquisitor was saying just to voice him. I think you can whisper you to multiple people. Yeah, true. I think you can maybe whisper to multiple people. I mean, we could still pretend it's a private I mean, conversation. Sure. If, if he's I, voicing yeah, that, them, it's not really a private conversation. Sure, I can. I can. I, 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 no. no, you can only whisper to one person. Never mind. All right, here we go. The Inquisitor is typing. <laughs> that sounds ominous. Oh, 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 no, oh, no. Relieve him of the artifact. I have no use for that failure of a team. Dispose of him if you need to. Brisora, the... That's private conversation. Yep. Yeah, the, the sign on the, on the thing, on the pauldron, that will be uh -huh. a very huge right flag for you. Ah, I don't know what it is. First, <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, I'm not. I'm not that huge into 40k, so I have no. It just so looks like armor to me. So There's basically, three emblems on there. Yeah, the emblem Hydra Dominatus is a slogan used by uh, the Alpha Legion, aka Chaos Space Marines, Ooh. for all about infiltration, yada yada. Okay, would she even know about the Alpha Legion? Probably. I don't think she would. Mm, that depends it's, on what like sector you're in and like who yeah. you've been fighting in the past. Yeah, because most space chaos space marine factions would be highly secretive information right, from uh, inquisitors. But nope, she, she doesn't were... know what it is. Okay, she doesn't. All right. Uh, nope, doesn't man. catch. Um. So, I would like to ask or uh, confirming the last order received, inquisitor, using the column response, but like you know the. Hey, for real, call and response. Yep. You know, like, you, you fucking sure you're, you're giving me what you just said? And he gave you the proper call and response. Very and well, then. That's the orders. Your character may be short-lived. <laughs> well, <laughs> he says relieve him. You don't have to kill him. I, I know. It, you... We all know what that is. Uh, that's not going to be my first option, obviously. Oh, Another I should lower my pistols in. Yeah, woohoo. I sigh heavily, and obviously. Uh, Keep it can. Seems mm. our Inquisitor has an issue with you holding the artifact. If you would kindly... Oh, hand us possession of the artifact as we return. Unhooks it from his belt and lightly underhands it towards you. Oh, I catch it. I nod. I appreciate this. And my belt. All right, let's get out of this emperor forsaken place. Right. Not forsaken when I'm around. No, it's still forsaken. <laughs> like you're, you're not consecrating the whole place. And in fact, that would be sacrilegious to do so. I would think. <laughs> To reclaim a uh, space hulk, they've done it yeah. before. Yeah, yeah, but <laughs> it just takes a lot of work. Yeah, my You're footprints are just yourself. like cleaning the ground as we walk. Let me know when you have it. Tell me what the inscriptions are. Are you sure you really care at this point in time? Can we not be off the space hulk? I mean, this seems like information and such you would want to verify. While it's not, oh, fuck you. I insist. <laughs> <laughs> it says. It's the wrong cylinder. <laughs> Librarian. <laughs> help. Do I, I notice at this point you're continuously talking to him. 
Librarian, if I may offer a suggestion. Please. <laughs> Turn off your external comms off the ship on your helmet. Oh, no. <laughs> I just go, bloop. Now you can ignore him and think in silence. <laughs> Hang on. I think I might have something better. Yes, it looks like... <laughs> and then I hit the button. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> All right, well, tell him where we <laughs> It appears we're breaking up. I believe oh, the no. warp is interfering with comms. <laughs> we're getting ambushed. Oh, no. <laughs> Blessed silence is much better than chaotic truths. If you know what that quote is from, please, please. <laughs> I'm afraid not. All right, now we're getting the fuck off of this ship, aren't we? Mm-hmm. Yep. Oh, hang on. I am going to... Or I'll make this so you can say it. So this is to Persora. You see me randomly collecting something from the last corpse. Report in! Oh, boy. I can't seem to get through to the kill team leader. <laughs> hey, he said in combat. <laughs> right. He did say in combat. <laughs> I need to retrieve the artifact and tell me what the inscriptions are. This is heresy. I'm presuming that's still only uh just a Brasora private that's comms. Fine. Okay, that's yeah. what I I'm letting you guys set the base out of character. Oh yeah. Well, we could go this way, but we also know that's where the dreadnoughts are. So true. Mm -hmm. And the dropship. We also know we can that... go around them. Yeah, the dropship ain't that way no more. So Yeah. I oh, okay. genuinely have no idea in character or out of character where yeah, I'm going. No worries. Yeah. Follow the team. I think it might be better to find a, another uh, exit point. I think we need to go south then. Yeah. Because otherwise we'll just be fighting through a horde of space marines. Was there anything on the right? Um, yes, there are many rooms of which I was hiding in. Awesome. I was ambushing the traitors. I insist, get the artifact by any means necessary. I need to know the inscriptions. The inscriptions are F and U. <laughs> That's only half the word. character would have rapport with this guy, Moth. You definitely know that this guy will not stop. That's why I turned off his, uh, his comms. Right, and he's been known, he's been known. Moth. Get a little obsessive? Uh, yeah, oh. obs not, not, well, not only obsessive, that, like, if he, if, after, after a while, he deems a mission, uh, unwinnable, he's an exterminous, heavy, heavy-handed individual. <laughs> Oh, that, Moth, that. you have a very, very fucked up microphone right now. Moth yeah. sounds he's like in he's character. inside a giant tin can. That's actually him yeah. in character. Uh. Yeah. Getting chaos corrupted. Beware, this is <laughs> as far as I came in the last hour or so. There may be another patrol. Hmm. I've been ambushing them very steadily over the past weeks. Hello, hello, is this better? Yes. 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 Ah. I may have accidentally messed up your external comms as well. So, you know, the, yeah, you know, this guy is not to be ignored. Right. So, Anyways. can I just like sneak peeks at the cylinder, just try and get what the inscription says without letting anybody you, know? Out of, out of character, you can, you can you also just ask me. Say, out of character, do you have the ability to just uh, uh, video comm, like or video vox? Nope. Nope. 
Al. It's, all, it's all comps. He's all just comming you guys at this point. Oh, no, I was asking if he had the ability to send out a video Vox. Uh, Live feed. I don't think we have his helmet. that yet. No. Not okay. sure. That was, yeah, I was completely out of character. So like you okay. Mm -hmm. uh, so you, you're able to jot down what these, those inscriptions are. Uh, you have no idea what they mean. Uh, you kind of just describe the, the shapes of the alien-looking symbols. There's a better question. Do they burn your eyes as you read them? <laughs> burn your eyes? Yeah. Is it chaos script? Hmm. He doesn't say no. So, I guess you could do a will power save there, Brasora. Let's do that. Oh, minus, minus 20. Uh, I am immune to fear and horrors, by the way, in case that helps. Okay. That doesn't necessarily stop it from, like, scolding you. Right. You so go, ahead, go ahead, read it. Oh, okay, what am I rolling? Minus will 20 uh, willpower. Trying to see if I have any other bonuses I can put on this. I'm also immune to the effects of demonic presence. We Wait. also get a plus 10 to willpower saves because of the oath we took. Sweet. Yeah, which oath did we take? I automatically win with one degree against Willfire saves. Nice. From uh, Alien. Oh, it's just, uh, it's just for Sora, though. Oh, okay. <laughs> he's, like, re um, he's reading the inscriptions on the cylinder. Cylinder. G. G. It. It, whatever. Just. Oh. So oh, your God. eye. Yeah, your eyes start bleeding. Uh, uh, would you consider what, this an attack? attack? No. All right. Do we notice their eyes bleeding? Moth, yes. would you like? Would you like me to pass you? I was about to say. Really, we can see through helmets now. Do you want me to pass you a fate point for that one? Uh, they bleed I mean, only a little. One. Yeah, sure. I don't. Anyway, is she holding the the uh, cylinder again? All right, I give you a fate nope, point. I never touched it. Oh, He's okay. just looking at it and just fixated on it at this point. I'm going yeah, so to re -roll just kind of yeah, swing out my arm. <laughs> I'm swinging out my arm. You can't see through the shield. <laughs> so, yeah, oh, your character is bleeding through the eyes and just staring at this thing, and, and you're describing it to him. And, yeah, you're still just fixated on it. Can we hear her speak? Nope. Or is, she, is it private? Okay. Can we notice anything weird from her? Uh, she's just standing there eerily, staring at it. Hasn't moved or anything really as far as you guys can tell you guys know it is a a artifact of great power that can't be trifled with you guys are debriefing all that so uh if i uh, yeah. if i notice at all that she's staring at i'm like like lift it up and just like move it around see if the gaze the helmet <laughs> follows oh my god yeah <laughs> yeah perfectly follows it sweet i'm, uh, I'm, I'm gonna put it in my fucking pouch by the way it wasn't in in the first place if this is a demonic or psychic thing, I am immune to its effects by spending a fate point. You can, if you want to, yeah. Yeah, no. Because of my pure faith, I am just immune to the effects of demonic stuff naturally. Uh, if I spend a fate point, I ignore attack rolls, whatever. Right. Uh, it's not demonic. I, you can I just am like, you're able to immune discern to that. its fear, its psychic presence, it's corruption gain, it's insanity gain. Okay. Definitely psychic, but definitely... So you're immune to psychic stuff? Uh, by spending a fate point, I'm immune to a single demonic or psychic attack. It's sure, not, yeah, a, psychic. It's, it's not yes. an attack, though. Oh. Ah. So I guess that wouldn't work. It's an attack I didn't on your eyes. One. I didn't take you, sister, for the one who kind who would read heretical texts. There's a reason I'm not part of the sisters anymore, and I'm an inquisitor. <laughs> mm. Right. Uh, so you want to discern kind of like what happened at all? Or you just want to move on? I'd recommend you stop staring at it. <laughs> <laughs> you seem... Well, as long as the inquisitor stops asking, we're good. Uh... So he says, 
All right. The Inquisitor is wasting our time with this. The Inquisitor has <laughs> been known to declare exterminatus at small trifles. Oh my that god. That was only partial inscriptions. Hang on. I wonder what communication frequency is the Inquisitor on? Have you opened the artifact? No. Librarian, what what frequency is the Inquisitor on? You can uh, say I've learned I too. wouldn't recommend you speaking with the Inquisitor. He has declared your team a failure. <laughs> uh, and I'm pretty sure the man who can't competently do anything other than exterminate would also be a failure. Yet here, I, I would agree wholeheartedly with you. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I'm amazed the other inquisitors haven't considered him a rogue agent and hunted him down yet. <laughs> He's effective. My chapter is not overly fond of the majority of the inquisitorious. As I turn and stare at the. At the Adeptus Sororitas. Mm. In Hello. fact, we've only had one very good interaction with them, aside from the illustrious Blackthorn. Typically, we tell them, no. I don't believe any chapter particularly likes an Inquisitor. Zora, I need the other portion. Ah. <sighs> <laughs> You saw you give out an exasperated sigh while bleeding from your eyes. Yep. And then I give him the rest of the inscription, I guess. <laughs> it's in the pouch. Uh, we can't read it. Is it? Yeah, so are, are you gonna give it house. are you gonna give it to him? <laughs> I I yeah, sure. No, I mean no. him. I have the artifact. <laughs> no, we're not giving the artifact to, to her. I just kinda like motion at the calm. <laughs> Is he pestering you too? Are you gonna inform them like who they're dealing with? The Inquisitor. Yes. What? Okay. <laughs> that 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 he declares exterminatus at small trifles. It's best not to fuck with him and jerk him around like this. Ugh, fuck's sake! I he toss will you the destroy cylinder. this Hulk. I toss you the cylinder. I warned you, Basara. If this thing takes you, I will kill you. <laughs> and I'd want you to. I'm gonna stand near Brusora with my chainsaw ready. Okay. Oh god. So you're opening it now? Opening hey, it? Oh god, no. no. He wants you to open it. Open it to read He the said other... give the rest of the inscriptions He's... on the surface. He Look asked, the last one. He asked the last if one. you open the artifact. He hasn't explicitly told you yeah, yeah. to do oh, it. Oh, okay. okay. He, he asked for the full inscription on the outside of it. This is not the place to open an artifact. Yes, and I do not intend to open this at all. Right, so... So, I mean, all the inscriptions you gave him on the surface level, he's asking you to open it and read the internal inscriptions on this. Oh, level. God. Oh, no. While she's doing that, I'm going to send my uh, eagle servo, my cyber eagle servo, uh, off in front of us to just kind of scout. Okay. I don't think it's a good idea to open this thing. <laughs> so you're going to do it with the team around, or are you guys going to do it in secret? Or I... I would say do not open the the thing on a space hulk behind enemy lines while we are still being hunted by the Black Legion. If Blackthorn wants his artifacts so preciously, he can wait a few extra minutes for us to get out of here. Otherwise, what good is this artifact to him still here? I have a plan. Hold on. Well, if he only needs what's written on it. Yeah, but opening it can unleash a demon. This artifact should be opened safely within a vault on a watch station. So, we do. There is no such thing with safe with these demon possessed bullshits. Agreed. Or psychic. But safe compared to our current situation. Are you guys well, scanning? I'd rather release a demon on a chaos hulk than release one in the Imperium somewhere. <laughs> right. I'd rather not release a demon. So are you guys gonna fly science it, scan it before you do anything? Are you gonna open it? Are you gonna just uh, continue on? Signy oh, science, signy science. I just wait. Uh, I would ask for a what a, a minute of time. He's probably not gonna send a dropship until we do this. Tell him we need the dropship. We have no way off this Hulk um, without him. Right, and um, he's mm. also been. You've heard rumors he's been known to leave. Kill teams just to die on some desert. Well, it's not just a rumor. Uh, well, 
Hi. Yeah, right. And he just left this guy to die. Right. Right. Exactly. He did turn off his comms, so that's half on him. Well, no, they got shot off. Brothers, I for uh. one tend to believe that it is better to die for the Emperor than live for ourselves. However, I also believe that this Inquisitor may not have the best intentions if he's asking us to open an artifact. It's true. He seems to be very greedy about heretical knowledge. He could be a heretic. Perhaps Doubtful. he wants us to open this In artifact the Inquisitor's dabble in the estate. heresy to protect the Empire, but he seems to be a little too eager. But, uh, I Depends recommend... on your definition of heresy, to be fair. My right. definition of heresy is opening an artifact on its face. By, by the Sisters of Battle definition of heresy, everyone here is a heretic. The Foolishness is bound to the heart. A chapter's disciplined, and the will of a chaplain drives it from him. I see no ch chapter to drive the foolishness from this Inquisitor's heart. I say we keep it sealed and continue on. He will send his dropship, or he will not. We go Personally, to the dropship. I prefer place. to continue li living to serve the Emperor. I say we just give him what he wants. Do you. That's your decision. You can also roll for it, too. Uh, Restore one last chance here. I do not recommend we open this here. We fought worse. We don't know what worse is in this. Besor, come hither. A moment of your time, please. Allow me to uh, take another peek nope, at nope, this nope. artifact. Nope. I know what you're like with those tentacles. Nope. <laughs> It's a servo arm, not tentacles. Then at least so, allow me to deploy a possibility shield around us. To at least oh, give us I'm an not edge saying of what don't do, don't prepare. I'm just saying we should do this. Alright. Go ahead, then. I'm going to stand over here just in case. Oh, you know what? I'll back into a small room. How about oh, that? there are plenty. Alright. And we will watch... You gonna close the door behind you then? Uh, no, you should probably leave it open and shoot if something goes wrong. Got it. You said also maybe grenades. grenades. All right, <laughs> I'm gonna deploy my uh, possibility shield. Mm -hmm. Brothers and sisters, this is a terrible idea. I urge you all to reconsider. Consider everything we do is a terrible so idea. You guys Jesus. are blind. Death right. watch. Right. Oh no. Fate point this. Okay. There we go. Alright, good. It's, it's not a not a devil. So I've deployed my possibility hmm. shield. Sweet. So let me know when you open it, Moth. So uh Let me know when everybody's ready. Fair enough. Hold on. Hold yeah. on, yes. So yeah. as soon as uh, Brisora tries to open the artifact, I will bash her in the head with the hilt of my sword, knocking her out. <laughs> you can try uh, to do that. I can very you much can try to do that. You can certainly try to do that. Uh, yes. Uh, what the fuck? I, oh my goodness. Who's writing? And uh, when I possibility shield, it was not including Brisora. Oh. Oh wow. Also, oh, so we we can't see the shield. It's like I cannot see the shield at least. Well, we the possibility the shield is more of a just. Yeah, I know. An area effect around me, you know. Okay. Yeah. So yep. So I strike Bristol with the hilt of my sword to knock her out. Can um, I see this coming? You're doing it I right now to knock her out. And I would like to have attempted to have distracted her. Considering well, my move. initiative and my observation mastery. Yeah, well, I, also not have, I also have lightning reflexes. I'm sorry. <laughs> I also have the ability to parry twice. Brazora, uh, look over I can here. Attack twice. Distraction. I, I guess parry. I, I can attack twice, actually. I can attack three times. Parry? Can you parry? 
could be You're distracted. Am Maybe? I distracted? Well, that's what I'm saying. I would like to try and distract. Okay. Yeah. Go for I don't it. know what what skill to roll against you on this would be. Performance. Oh wait, wrong game. Uh, there is deceive. Yep. There you go. Yeah, right, go. You're in another room. No, no, oh, I'm, I'm the one doing the it. Room. But that seems like the skill to roll, which is bad because it's not gonna. Yeah. Oh my god, I succeeded. <laughs> <laughs> What's the opposed on that though? Uh, sense motive. Or uh, scrutiny, scrutiny, probably scrutiny. Yeah. Woo! Observation mastery applied. Yeah. Oh, boogers. It's okay. Yeah. No, he, he's oh, not. I, I had to roll against a twenty-three point five. Like I knew you were. I knew my attempt wasn't gonna really succeed. Hold on. It might have succeeded. Um, oh, Harry Moss. Here's gameplay thinking that is right. And you're getting a plus ten because possibility shield. While this happens, I'm gonna Oh yeah, I can start to see. All right, I will just do another one. Don't worry about it. You're gonna just straight up attack him. Oh, God. I, I am. I am basically trying. Hitting to... her with the butt of the sword. Not... Butt, butt of the sword. Yes. Like they felt, not the fucking chain blade. Oh, I guess you and Moth are fighting. Uh oh. Oh. And the third attack. I thought Moth can only parry once. I can parry twice. He can parry twice. Okay. But I, I can attack twice. Well, you're not it's the turn order combat, so I guess you can parry as many times as you're attacking him. Well, I no, also no, 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 have no. the ability to disengage as a half action while using my jetpack the full move, so... Right, but... Kurnoff attacks, and he gets three attacks during his attack. Oh, okay, got Yikes. it. And you got two parries, which means he hits you with his third attack. Then it can be your turn. Clink, clink, donk. You Four. are effectively stunned for a number. Of, let me see how it actually works. Hold on. Can you do that three times, or is it only you get one chance to do that hit? Let me see. You I really don't want him to open it. <laughs> oh, I don't think honest. any of us except Resora wants to open this thing. Hey man, um, I follow orders. Mm. Good soldiers follow orders. Right. And Resora has a history with this Inquisitor almost as much as the other Inquisitor. Now, now whether or not Resora likes this Inquisitor, that's up to that character. I don't like him at all. The dude's a dickbag, but he will declare Exterminatus on shit. I right. would rather not be left for dead. Right. So that's what your character's perception of him is. You, but you you also know that he gets shit done. So Yes. So your character knows that. And that, that the other Inquisitor does trust him. So he's a trusted Inquisitor. We can't just tell him we need an extraction now. We don't have the ability to read it, the device out. Mm -hmm. I mean, you could literally tell him that you're crying blood and the blood is getting in the way of being able to read it. Well, probably we gotta, say keep going. We got to resolve. Yeah, he would. <laughs> uh, he, he, he sacrifices people, Copler. He doesn't give a fuck. Yeah, it's true. You feel I mean, your he, life? Yeah, he told he, he told the, you know, Eric Lady is in, in the... Uh, the failure, if you have to, to get that artifact, he doesn't care. But space marines are like a brotherhood, so they would care a little. I've. I wouldn't, but I didn't hear that part of the conversation. We have to a takedown, I think. Mm -hmm. In in the chat, in the Death Watch chat. I'm not sure, actually. Um. Well, I mean, you want five people to declare a takedown. Engaged, fatigue, no. So is it, is it, is it, how much damage does it see? Okay, so you have to I make I think this is a separate thing from an attack, so you don't get three of them in a row. Got it. It's a half action. Half action. Well, then would you actually be able to parry? I should be able to parry twice, yeah. Would I be able to parry a takedown, though? That's the question. Yeah, that's that's the question. Mm. 
No, Seal. So instead of doing a parry, it says you must make a toughness test. Yep, toughness test. Well, would, but if would, it does it say would, if the character hits, though, and it is a weapon skill test, so I yeah. guess it depends on the wording of yeah. parry. Oh, uh, so the third hit when mm. it hits you, so do your toughness check. Would again. he get a third hit though? Is the question because he's only got two half actions. Where's that three attacks coming from? Is that like from a skill Lightning or attack. a build? Oh yeah, then I'd say you can get three. Is that three per half action, or is that three for a full action? Per full action. Three for a full round action? Yeah. So I, I could say a third hit. So right they would be different things then. So he could. You'd have to a, use a full round action to attack, which means. And which means you only do, do take down full, once. No, if he could do, if he did two. Or you half can't use actions, take down at all. If he did two half actions, that would be four attacks. Quote. Right. No, no for, a mo for lightning strike is a full action move. Right. Yeah, so it's oh. a, it's a separate thing entirely then. Yeah. But awesome. you, you would be doing a lightning strike instead of a turn. takedown. Oh, okay. So you'd be dealing damage. Yeah. And you can only do one attack action per turn, so he couldn't do two half action attack actions. Got it. So he could only use takedown one time. Makes sense. Yep. So he dodged you dodged it then. I parried. Right. Try to hit you by the weapon, and you parried. Rude. That was the response in character. Rude. Yeah. <laughs> what am I going to do? Attack you guys? That's just stupid. Is this mm -hmm. argument still going on in character? Can we all hear it? Yes. Yeah, you hear them. Hear them what? Boko? She says rude. Oh. That artifact is best opened in a more contained and controlled environment. We are this not getting not off this that. ship. We will not get off this ship unless he gets his information. I'm telling you that right now. He will send another kill team to kill us to get this. And then read it here. Sorry, this is the stun action. But Brazor, how do you know that? We were able to make use of our situation in more dire straits. That was another Inquisitor. It was another Inquisitor, but... I seem yeah, to recall that old. we all formed a ring and flew through outer space away from a ship that, that was got a blown different, up. That, that was a different ship. So, and a different Inquisitor and a different... That was months right. ago. Didn't that ship we landed on crash into the planet and kill one of us? It almost uh, killed... Yes, one of my librarians died. Oh, yeah. No. No, he didn't. I think all my librarians... Maybe one did. One Maybe did. Maybe one librarian died. One did. Everyone one survived. One I one think in the two crash, one on the ship. Yeah. Either way, bad. sister, I like our odds better if we try and escape on our own than open this relic that has unknown You want, you want to steal a Chaos Marine dropship if you can even find one? I think that's a worse idea. Um, I think that's a better record. idea than opening an artifact and getting killed by whatever horrors await us. We fought bigger than what this thing's going to release, probably. Are you hitting me again? Who? <laughs> no, Here's the question. No, why would uh, why would we open a Xenos art or heret heretical artifact in heretical territory rather than return it to the sanctum of a secure... How are you going to get place? back? He left you here to die with it. Brazora, he will leave us the here to die with details. it. You want to open a Xenos artifact outside yes. of the approved places. That is heresy. Straight up, I am part of the Inquisition. This is okay. We are being told by Inquisitor to do this. I am a throne agent. Never this is heresy? authorized to do. But are you authorized to do it? Are He's literally agreeing. authorizing me to do it right now by telling me to open it. But and I pop Christ it open. I get, oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, we'll save him, everyone. Oh, God. Minus, minus 60. Minus 60? Oh, no. Yeah. Is this a psychic oh. thing? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, All right. I can attempt to oh. negate it. Okay, completely. cool. Do so. Have, uh, oh, God. Um, 
What is this alien witchcraft or what is this? I have a thing for I automatically <laughs> win with one degree. Uh, it's not alien. Because this right. is a um, an old imperial, old old imperial vessel. Is this technically? Uh, first of all, are we still branded? Oh, oh. we should. I'm not. I don't remember. Give me a minute. Let me check. Right. And then we, after we this, after did this, that to yeah. come on board, didn't we? Maybe. I think so. Then we yep, so then is this? Then is this a psychic attack? Have it. Yep. And we'll end, well after this we'll end it here because I gotta head out soon. All right. All right. Is this a psychic psychic ability? Sorry. Yeah. Well, it's emanating. Okay. From I negated from it completely. Sweet. For yourself or everybody? No, it's for everyone. Oh wow. Yeah. So so you're you're able to stop whatever yeah. it's doing. Yeah. I sensed the going bam, just stopped it from happening. Pow. See, nothing happened. <laughs> Sister, we were just assaulted by something. Surely you all felt it. Nah. What's in the box? Yeah, what is in it? So, well, I mean, it's, it's, it was initially glowing, and he stopped it. It stopped glowing, and, uh, you know. Is there a tiny little demon inside going? No. <laughs> no. It looks like kind of like a glowing orb emanating from the inside of it, like it's something contained. <clears throat> you don't really see any inscriptions. Then mm -hmm. I s report it to the Inquisitor what's inside. Seal that shit immediately. It's assaulting us. Right. Uh, you can handle so it. Seal it. This is you know, not what, what, something what are you, to be trifled with outside of a secure... What are you re room. relaying to him? Uh, th there's a little glowy orb inside, and it pulls out a psychic... Try reading... Wave... Try reading the inside of the container. He said there was itself. nothing inside. Yeah, but like there, uh, there might be an inscription. He said there wasn't. Coco right, just said no. there was no inscriptions inside. Yes, someone grabbed. There that are inside. not, and then I seal it back up. Glowing orb. There should be inscriptions. Seal it. We can figure this out later. We need to leave. I already did. Tell him. Right. Okay, someone take it from her, please. Is I there some psycho messing it? with it? Nope. <laughs> so you're now lying. you lie to the Inquisitor. Yeah. <laughs> After we question. open the Now our... we've decided this is a good yeah. idea. This is a bad idea. Hey, hey. <laughs> as long as he gives us a dropship, I don't care. Listen, do you hear? I believe there are Black Legion approaching. We should make haste and leave. All right. I get into a combat stance. Send us a dropship, sir. You can examine it in full when we get off this hole. <laughs> we're under attack. <laughs> Tell them that. Let's fucking go. Tell the Inquisitor we're under attack. Nah. <laughs> well, maybe he'll stop asking questions. Yeah, open it up while you're you know, being assaulted we, by We him. already did say we were under attack, and he's like, just read it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you taking time to shoot? Read just bring me the artifact, the dropship you came on is your escape. I will send in another team to retrieve and get me the details I need. So wait. That's what he is said. There another cylinder? No. <laughs> I think he's well, saying he's going to kill the rest of the kill team and you're the only one who's going to get out. Probably. Oh god. Well, you might be killing an Inquisitor later. <laughs> If we eh. survive, Jesus. Do you wanna? Do you wanna do like discernment or anything to? to... Yes. Okay. Scrutiny. I think it's scrutiny. That's it. So scrutinize. So plus plus thirty since you previous screens with him. Ooh. Yeah. You get observation man. I get all right? the information. Holy yeah. so, shit. So. Yeah, so the gist of what he said to you is basically he is going to just... He, he thinks you guys are in, so incompetent, you can't get it. He knows you have the artifact for sure. Uh, he's just going to wipe you guys out and take the details he needs. He, he considers you guys failures and tainted or something. Oh. That's what that's what you're discerning from that information there. This sounds very, like a fucking moronic inquisitor. Like, genuinely. Uh, sure. Yep. 
No, literally everything's a failure. Like, no. Yeah. <laughs> Just fucking idiot. I mean, that's upper command. I mean, you, you can imagine Welcome they're all a bunch of morons. Yeah. Can we speak to the Inquisitor's manager? I would like to speak emperor? to the Emperor. <laughs> um, like, you can do I that. Mean, Just I have the ability to deny him access right. to stuff. Like, so, genuinely. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, Inquisitors can only go so far with commanding uh, yeah. Space Marines anyway, so and, yeah. we still have the ability to just fucking kill this guy. The Keeper <laughs> is also... The reason I went with the Keeper is because there are things that Inquisitors can't demand of them. Mm. So they're they're literally, literally guardians of, like, forbidden knowledge. That's why I was saying, tell him no. Yep. Well, yeah. I'm Space Marine. <laughs> <laughs> I don't take orders from you. Well, give me the artifact, then. Yeah. I'll give it to the Psyker who knows how to stop whatever bullshit this thing <laughs> Also, we're That's gonna fair. have a kill team sent against us and we're gonna be assassinated. Yeah. So. I take it back, yeah. I look to the Keeper, I can't give this back to you, but as she says, I am capable of stopping whatever comes from this thing. Very well. As a Keeper, no, don't give it to the Inquisitor until we get off. Right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, by the way, he's sending a kill team to kill us, so we're not getting off. Unless yeah, but you want he to kill just more said the dropship that we came on is our escape. You know, Non-heretical one. I mean, it, it, he won't kill you, per se. Because you're I not... I didn't say that to them. I said he'll kill us. Right. He well, thinks that we means it would have to be a completely... Because we didn't read the inscription. Well, it would also mean it would have to be a completely separate kill team from another section of the Death Watch. Because yes. the only other... We uh, have plenty of time. Death Watch is on that sh that he had immediate access now, to. Now here's the was other was my librarians, and there's no way in hell they would they would just go and kill me. Right. That's so, true. and I'm probably the only keeper in the sector. Probably yeah. unlikely. Yeah. So here's the other thing, right? This place is filled with chaos marines, including enemy dreadnoughts. So. An opposing kill team is going to have to fight through all of that before it can get to us. Oh, no, no. That's true. Uh, if you read his, what he said, he says... Oh. He'll Escape. send another kill team on the dropship, get to the dropship location, and we'll kill them there. You're right. He's going to wait till you guys get, get the artifact to him and then eliminate you guys. Because as far as he's concerned, you guys are tainted. Or stupid. Or incompetent or something. I mean, he does... He that is projection. He Inquisitor who has decided to kill two separate captains... <laughs> and the keeper. I'm sorry. This, this inquisitor is... is not long for this. The one. first one he sent to their deaths. Actually, <laughs> yep. he didn't decide to kill them outright. Right. Which uh, watchtower do you come from? While we're discussing, two separate ones. Separate ones. Okay. That's what I'm. I'm pres yeah, I'm presuming we both came from two different watchtowers. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, I mean three now. Actually, with you around. Yeah, with you, it's now three separate watchtowers. Uh, my group came from a different one, and I led a squad of librarians. Um, so this inquisitor has caused the loss of several librarians, two captains from two different watchtowers. No, my librarians are part of a different mission, but okay, I'm just joining this squad for the assault. Also, they're still alive. And yeah, except for two, but yeah, the rest of them are still alive. They're just in. Recovery. They died in glorious battle. Well, one Very died well. in glorious. One battle. died the in died battle. In the other one died in, in glorious crashing. Crash. Yes. Very right, well. Well, I think we need to have a speak, uh, a chat with a watch commander. Yep. Uh, which? Well, one of their watch commanders is one dead. One of them died. Yeah. I'm sorry. What? What? what yeah, that, that entire tower is gone. Yeah. And yeah, that, well, this has brought multiple eyes looking down on this. Again, Why do you think they're with the Inquisition? That was a separate Inquisitor. Right. And that was more of a. It was assaulted by a greater demon, which we can. That's fair. Yeah, we Which is why demon. I think we totally could have handled whatever demon was going to pop out of this thing if one popped out, and none did. So, justify. Well, well, you you never know. It could have drove us all insane, and we could have murdered each other. It could have been a I'm immune to the effects of insanity. Screw we, we also don't have my squad of fuck off everything uh, uh, space uh, librarians. Well, anyways, at any rate, if there is another kill, you got. Team, I I was with them and handling and the bad. chaos mech, and you guys were taking out the greater demon. And you're saying oh, yeah. North? I was going to say, irregardless, I am still, you know, beyond reproach and a keeper. So if there is another kill team, I will explain the situation that this Inquisitor is going beyond what should be his bounds and now threatening and has left behind a keeper 
on a mission, and so two separate kill teams, and it, that we yeah. use people to watch Commander. May or may not be another Death Watch team. So point is, is a, now we have a dropship coming to get us. You're welcome. Yes, if it is a Death Watch team, we will speak to them. We have a librarian. We have a tech marine, a keeper. Two of us are captains. Oh yeah, there's and two. A keeper. Oh, yeah, so there's two captains, a keeper. Wait, are you a librarian and a captain? Considering it took a month. To yes. Get okay. Like I'm a captain of librarians. I don't know. Boko's. Oh no 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 I know. no 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 I know what you're talking about. Yeah, because librarians have different ranks. Yeah. 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 Okay, so but once I would captain, be a high rank, a high rank, yes, yes. No kill team would us accost us without at least listening to what we have to say. That is not a party that is easily influenced. By You're cats. assuming it's going to be more Death Watch, and it, it could be just more, Inquisition because he well, could just true. want a quick group. Because well, how long did it take enemy. to get our group of Death Watch out here? About a, a month. month? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so he's not going to wait another month to get this one. He already has it in his hand. He's going to send Inquisition agents. Identity? It was just, like, floating around the ship? No, what the only it? other Death Watch team would have been my No, 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 I'm saying, I was, I actually, your, your dropship, oh. did it, like, leave leave, or, like, what happened to it? It landed on another landing pad, as far as I know, he went and, and, and then left. They didn't leave. It oh, it, so your pilot's still there, so he's just repositioning that, right? Oh. Yeah. Those yeah, so... Still. No, yeah, so there would be a on it. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like, from what I remember, our dropship left. No, got he someone to a different drop pad by the chaos, and then that, that's what I was saying. Yeah. If the drop repositioned, ship just repositioned. It's it's not here. Yeah, it's gonna be the same dropship, so it's not gonna have other people on it. So we can just get on the dropship either way. Yeah, yeah. No, we're good then. Yeah, let's go. And then we'll just force the pilot to take us to a, wa uh, a watchtower. Right, because okay. as far as that that pilot is concerned, he's not in comms with the Inquisitor, so. Yeah. So we'll go him. to a watchtower and we'll just simply lock up this artifact in the watchtower and I will talk to the watch commander and we'll go from there. Yeah. If we I'm get sure out of here alive. Don't don't bring about <laughs> a heavy heart into this conversation. Look, we've, out of worse. Emperor, we've survived worse. We can make it out of the death. Faith this in the Emperor and a heavy hand. Now, onward with us. Let us leave. Yep. And okay, so we'll end it here. Uh, do you guys get 1,000 XP for that? 1,000? 1,000? Yeah, yeah 1,000. That's pretty sweet. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, I thought it'd be light like light, light combat and some RP going on. I did. And I had, yeah, I had to change the Inquisitor's demeanor a little bit since I was like, well, you know, a good introduction would be to bring him in that he's a survivor on the ship. And that since the Inquisitor already was a dick to begin with, I'm like, that would make sense. He'd send another team to go retrieve it. So I'm without telling us there was another team already on. He doesn't, he doesn't give a shit about you guys. Yeah, I know. He care, he care less. <laughs> so You're meta, just... meta wise, out of character, um, I actually knew that uh, North's character's introduction would be encountering him, and it was funny because he and I joked about how we might get into an altercation over the artifact. I <laughs> called it. <laughs> I called it from a mile away. I was like, you know, they might they might try and kill me for that artifact. That was literally the first instruction I was given by the Inquisitor. <laughs> <laughs> it was relieve him of the artifacts, no matter how you have to do it. Mm -hmm. Yep. And that's when I was like, that's why I was like, hey, I need you to give me the artifact, respectfully, I sir. I was reading it. I was like. You know what, as long as the artifact gets off of here, I think the fallen comrades will be seated. <laughs> I still can't but, believe that we opened a fucking artifact on a space hole filled with chaos. Yeah, fucking I, I tried to words. imitate it like an ambush thing. I messaged you, Mug, and Tess yep. about it. Yep. And, but it kind of failed. So sorry, Ma. <laughs> but now it sounds like you're all on board with F that Inquisitor, so you don't care anymore. All right? I need to go find the nearest watch commander. I mean, yeah. legal reasons. As far I mean, as as far as we're concerned, <laughs> this Inquisitor is a heretic. Well, so what I love is this description. Even an Inquisitor may not pass a keeper without special remit from a watch commander. So as soon as I get to a watch commander, I'm golden. <laughs> <laughs> I can imagine the Inquisitor is going to try and thwart us on that one. Probably. Yeah. Right. That's what's going through my mind, is that there is something very right. wrong with this this Inquisitor. Uh, yep. well, as far as Moss characters know, this is his straight-up MO, so he is... Yeah. I will say, though, that even He's in war... He's always like this. 
any Inquisitor that's too heavy-handed with uh, Sir Magnardus uh, are usually declared rogues. Yeah. Yes, and, and they're hunted down. Character. So my Unless character, they're exceptionally effective at it. Yeah, so they're characters that, which he is. Guy. has a very bad history with the Inquisition as it is. Who does? Uh, my space character. Wolves. Oh, okay, yeah. that's perfect then. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. No, not the Space Wolves, although my character has worked with the Space Wolves before on that specific instant which you're referring to. Yes, no, my character's oh, oh, shit. bad. Actually, bad, bad North, history. did you want to include the documentation, or are you going to wait to... Wait I will until... actually... I will let you guys see this, because by now I'm sh I'm going to presume you would have had the ability to see some of this. Sure, start uh, up in Death Watch chat. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to share with you guys two documents, uh, one of which will have pulled up when you actually like looked up my character, like or when my we were like talking and stuff. Just an automated little response for you. But yes, generally, uh, depending on the, the watch commander, you might may or may not be safe from that equipment. Oh man, you're also an ancient? Oh yeah, no, if this guy's gonna fuck over an ancient... <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's got another thing coming to him. <laughs> a very, very old ancient. Well, they call him ancient for a reason. <laughs> no, no, no. So I, I know he knows what a, what an ancient really is. That is not someone you just kill. Yeah, it's not even it's not even first founding like guys. This is. So my personal theory, my headcanon on this Inquisitor is that he's a heretic and he wants to get a hold of chaos technology and use it to uh, enrich himself in some way. That's what I think is going on. Possibly. But not, not, that's out of character. My character is just like, what the fuck is this yeah. Inquisitor doing? But yeah, Ma's character knows... This is him verbatim, and all the encounters he's ever had with him. This is what he does. Yeah, exactly what he does. Artifacts, no artifacts. He likes to get in, get the details, get out, if possible. Like extraction is like a tertiary thing in his mind. Right. That's why we need to make it a primary thing in his mind. New yeah, objective: survive. Care. <laughs> was literally what I've been saying the whole time. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. When I got my intro, it was new objective, survive. Right. Yeah, he'll just keep sending teams until he gets what he needs. Right. So he's what not... you what you have to do is partially obey him, get him to send a ship, kill the guys he sends, then come back with it. Yeah, I don't <laughs> right. know what happened to them. They all got ambushed by chaos. I can't know what to tell you. We're the right. second team that he sent, so we need a third team to come get us, and then we kill all them, and then we get out. <laughs> or, or. <laughs> Convince them to join us, and then the three teams get together, go back, and kill them. That might be bad. Your moth character knows that might not be the best choice, but... Yeah, but it, it probably wouldn't. We'd have to get the Inquisition to go after him. Yeah, uh, just, uh, just go and talk to that previous Inquisitor, get him on board. The previous and... Inquisitor loves this guy. He's he's fine with him. I, I don't yeah. know about love, but I think just... Okay, I wouldn't say love. That. I would say respect and respect. accept what he does. And, and yeah, he knows he's very loyal. The Inquisitors oh, have right. not come after him for a very good reason. He is good at what he does. Which Order unfortunately Kronos, leads to a lot really? of deaths. Okay, hey. all right. <laughs> that's, that's 40k for you. That's like literally 40k. They send, <laughs> they send you guys on suicide missions all the time. What do you and have? You're literally Order death Kronos. watches in your name. Yeah. What's up? An no, I'll so, I would just no, say that. Never mind. You. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, Dan. No, no, but like uh, the amount of preparation for this is kind of incredible, to be honest. Wow. Thank Damn. you. Yeah, we, yeah, yeah, we've been going back and forth, but I was like, when I saw that, I was like, holy crap, yeah, he's really digging it. So I, been... I actually have, yeah, I have a full fledged backstory. Yeah. Um, with Krom and uh, the chapter. So I'm assuming you're probably going to go to your watch captain to have, to have a discussion about this Inquisitor then. Um. Yeah, so my, well, if I can do it in, in a roleplay, I'm going to go back to my tower and talk to my watch captain and commander about this and see what's... Right. Well, we're all probably going to be joining you on the way to that tower. The reason Most being likely. is because I have a clavis, and a clavis can open locks that inquisit inquisitors 
actually can't. You need to have a clavis to open the locks. So I just, yeah. I'm just going to take this object and lock it in the vault. And then either the Inquisitor has to openly attack a, a watchtower. You not a good do. idea. You yeah, that's that. not a good idea. All I have to do is lock it in there, no matter what. It's golden. Uh, so then, unless he convinces the watch commander, he's not getting it. That's that's at least what's going through my mind right now. Right. Is, uh, so your character actually has some prior knowledge with him as well. As far as you know, your watch commander tolerates him. Yes, and that, 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 that's, 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 what I was gonna that's that's the extent of it. Like he tolerates him. Uh, he knew this was a death uh, suicide mission going in, so he sent his best team, which would be you guys. So, I'm going to report and, back mission success. However, there was uh, some betrayal. At least right now, that's what I'm probably. I mean, say. yeah. I mean, he probably won't been... there as such because he knows that he knows this guy's mo as, mo as well. Yeah, and you you sort of knew going in. You just didn't know to what extent. <laughs> I would imagine. Uh... Uh, Krom's watch commander would not be thrilled uh, hearing about how the Inquisitor wanted to leave him for dead. Uh, he wouldn't be pleased, but not right. much. He not much he can do that wouldn't be act, you know active. No, but if I can get if I can get Moff's character and the rest of this this second kill team uh, to converse with him, that would be enough as evidence, I think, for a watch yeah. commander. To yeah, bring yeah, yeah. Charges of heresy uh, to or against an inquisitor. Uh, either, yeah, you could do that, or like basically get the guy to back off, or whatever. Because mm -hmm. I know I can't can't get him to stop, and I doubt anyone here could. But a watch. Oh, he doesn't. Could. Yeah, they, that, that, yeah. So if you know that inquisitor gives doesn't give two shits about the hier the hierarchy of the space marines. He doesn't give a shit. Oh, which is why I'm going to go through a different route. Right. Do that or go find the Minotaurs. <laughs> mm -hmm. True. They love killing chaos. The problem is the Minotaurs also really like the Inquisition. Yeah. All right. Since that can conclude it. Yeah. Yep. Go take a shower and get ready for practice. Sweet. All right, then. If anyone has feedback on those documents, by the way, please feel free to tell me. Uh, well, feedback is good shit. Great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, good one shit. One of you said it looks like shit, and the other one said it no, looks No, I said good shit. I said good oh. shit. <laughs> I, <laughs> yeah. See you guys next week. I'll Later, bro. See you. See and, uh, see you. I just I want, I want you guys to know that I helped Norsk with the formatting, and it was a oh, bitch to get right. It oh, was nice. such a pain in the ass because all of that is manually placed. Oh, yeah. nice. Yep. All right. Um, all right. right. So, next Peace week. Out. See ya. Oh, yeah. Hopefully, dude will be here, too. All right. I'm saying. Now Cheers. I get to stay awake since it's 7, almost 8 a.m. <laughs>